What's up guys, welcome back to another day in Ark. Here we are on Scorcher. The Marshal is in town. Okay, I don't know what's possessing me, but I'm gonna go try and get a Faso. I did it. It took so freaking long. Where's my Faso? There it is. We've got a male Faso. It was a 125 when I tamed it. Let me show you guys what it looks like. These things are crazy. And they are actually extremely good swimmers. Believe it or not, who would have known? Okay, so. There's the Faso. That's what it looks like. It's still got a little bit of the Easter colors on it. It's looking pretty beautiful. Who's landing here? Aim goat. Okay, so we're gonna go and get a female. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready for this. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? I don't know if I'm ready for this. Okay, but before we do that, before we do that, there's a couple of things we need. We need some grenades. I got seven. I might need to make a few more grenades first. And we're going to need something that we can run around with. I'm thinking a saber tooth. Let's see. Now, I did fill up. Fantastic. It's all still here. I was about to say, I did put wood in the Indie Forge. Let me get that quickly. We'll take it to my, my game bench and then we'll make some grenades up there quickly. This is going to be painful. This is going to be so painful. Why? <laughs> because we want one! Yes! Because we want we want a breeding pair. Because we want a breeding pair. That's why. We need a breeding pair of assos. I also want to actually maybe go get another vulture. Oh, a nice green one in the desert the other day. And I thought, Ooh. Vultures, they can actually save your life when you do a cave and you get knocked out by a scorpion or a titanoba or something. They can save a knife when you take a nap. Then they'll attack the scorpion or the snake or whatever is attacking you. They might kill it. These things are badass. Okay, gunpowder. Let's turn this bad boy on. Let's hit that gunpowder quickly. I might have to go get some crystal. I think I got some metal. Do I need metal? Oh, snap. I'm out of metal. I'm out of metal. Wait, there's some... Okay, there's some metal. We don't need a lot of grenades. Maybe if I can make 10 more, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. So I got some metal. Got gunpowder. We're gonna have crystal. Going good, boys. It's going well. Alright, as soon as these slots actually start opening, I'm gonna start putting these ones in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've got eight available or more charcoal slots. Okay, and I got my shotgun. I got 181. We're gonna have to go tame a saber. Because when the Faso dismounts you, you are just, just not fast enough to run away from it. So the idea is... You can have someone fly with an RG, pick you up, carry you out of range, and the faster will be aggro and you can go back. Or, I'm hoping, I can throw out the saber, jump on the saber, and ride off without the faster being too unhappy about the situation. And I will see. So that is the plan. That is the plan. Let's see if that works. Okay, let's see if we can start putting these. Okay, so we need one more slot open. Fantastic. Yo, Morrison! What's happening, Morrison? How are you guys doing? You guys good? <laughs> what you guys up to? And there's charcoal. All right, now let's see what the grenades are going to cost me. 
Oil I have, fiber I have, hide I have, stone metal I got, gunpowder we are making, and stone. We need some stone. You hunting a tapa? Oh. Vixen did say last night she wants a beautiful tapa. Okay, here's the dodie. Let's grab this dodie and we go smack some stone quickly. They be rolling, they hating. Morrison, what's your rock golem doing over here? What's he doing over here? In front of Tony's house. She's just guarding. Okay, let's hit some stone. He's a bodyguard? <laughs> No man, come fetch him, come put him by your house. Poor Tony's house is always so full of stuff. I'm actually considering taking the breeding uh, pen and the air cones away. Poor guy can't run out and there's 20 babies in front of his house. Security. Well, I wouldn't mess with him. They are pretty ferocious. Okay. Let's throw these things away. Take me away. <laughs> um, let's get some more. I don't need a lot of stone, but this will be worth it. Might need some stone a little bit later as well. Okay, that should be enough stone, I think. That should definitely be enough stone. Whee! Alright, let's roll to my door. Grab the stone. Put the stuff in the fabricator. Okay. Grenades, grenades. Granada. Oh, we make him in the smithy. Not him in the fabby. Shows you how long ago I made grenades. Put that in. Grab the metal over here. The little bit that I have. Grab the oil. Grenades. 26 of them. <laughs> nice. Tattoo. What's up, Shane? How you doing? Yeah. This is going to be painful, man. <laughs> this is going to be painful. I did tape one, but oh my greatness. This is going to be horrible. These things take forever. Forever, ever? Yes, forever ever. That's so taming tonight. How you doing, Shane? How's things going? Let's just pop this guy back into the community center here. Did you see our town? Did you see the town we built? Look at this. This is the jail. It's an actual jail. Oh! There we go. We've got a life sentence there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we built an entire town, man. Where did my sign go? Who stole my sign? Someone stole my sign. That's the workshop. Our church. General store. The glue factory. I mean, need I say more? Our vacation with the pantless gang and the rock rock. What? With the pantless gang and the rock and roll. See hot sauce for help. <laughs> Squirrel taxidermy. This is the saloon. Yeah, we got a saloon. Very cool. Our veggie place. Not sure what this is. I'm not sure what this is. 
train station is behind here. There's the train station. You got... Ah, uh, sweet. Cool, cool. Just thought I'd give you a quick glimpse of town. See, my sign is missing. I don't know who took my sign. It means I'll have to put up a new one. I think I know who that was. That must have been... Ben with his... Fire and oil. The train station's done, I can go check. Alright, sweet, I'll go check Marjan. Alright, let's grab the grenades here. I don't need the fuel. Might need that. I have my weapon with me. Okay, so now... Next up, boys, next up, we need... Following. I need to go get a disposable saber. We need to go get a disposable saber. Do I still have some darts? We do. Okay, we got some darts. Yeah. Let's quickly go fly and see if we can get a disposable saber. Because that's what I want to use to get away from the Faso. Let's see if we can see any. I did. Me and Tony, we tamed the Oasis. Now I'm gonna tame a Faso, hopefully. <laughs> I'm saying hopefully, because I'm not too sure how this is gonna go. 145. Ooh, that's the one. That's the one right there. Get him? Yeah, I got him. Alright, let's take him. Gonna put him in the top pen over here. Oh, we missed. We missed. We missed. We'll go again. Oops. Alright, we grabbed him. Let's turn around. And drop. Boom, and he's in. Okay, fantastic. What did we use to tame it? Shotguns and long necks. Shotguns and long necks. And we had. I brought over a Bronto baby from the island. Well, not the baby, a dead Bronto. I brought over a Bronto that we actually killed and we took the soul. A Brontosaurus worked pretty well, man. Two, two waves, just two waves and done. Oops. Ooh, that was, that was quite a big one. How did that not even hit him? <laughs> I'm running around in the pen with the saber. I'm gonna kill this thing. He's gonna die. Maybe he got some injuries back there. Ah, there we go. Alright. Fantastic. 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 Now. We need to go collect some prime. But in fact, we can wait a little bit. We can wait a little bit. We can wait for this bad boy to just take a nap nap. Hmm. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Alright, let's go grab a saddle for it so long. And a cryopod. Yeah, this is my oasis or Hello buddy. Hello buddy. What's up my guy? 
Yippee butter, you made it to a stream. It's been a while, man. Haven't seen you in a while. Yeah, yeah, Ben, 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 Ben. What did you do? I have a feeling everything is now damaged. Why, Ben? Ben threw all jars on my house and then set my house on fire. Uh, why am I here? Yes, we need saddles. There's a saber saddle. Let me see if I got more. Let me see if I got some more saddles. It was not me. Uh, I knew. I know it was you, Ben. Do you know how I know it was you? You're the only one that plays around with the oil jars. <laughs> I knew it. Where is my sign, Ben? There was a sign that said Marshall. Where's my sign? Yeah, you can throw oil jars on someone's house and set it on fire. Yes. Yep. I can show you guys. I would guess it burnt down. That is a pretty good guess. That is a pretty good guess. Same as my one foundation. What do we have? Do we have any actual saddles somewhere? Zema? I'm coming to the store. I'm coming to the store. I'm looking for a saber saddle. It's a little big. Yes, that looks better. Okay, so what we got? Tools, liquids. Furniture and deco. Yo, that sounds horrible. We don't have any saber saddles? I guess we don't have any saber saddles. Yeah. Well, I'll have to use that one then. You didn't put the oil there? Yeah, I'm sure about it, babe. <laughs> I'm sure about it. Mm -hmm. I wonder who had fire arrows. Who had fire arrows? Do we? Do I have oil jars? Let's see. Do I have any oil jars? I don't think I do. No, I don't think I got oil jars. Not a single one. And there's a foundation missing. You guys are terrible. So Ben, you, you happened to tell me you were just casually walking by and saw that my house was on fire. And if it's really not you, then I know there's only one person it could be. Let's, let's blame Tony again. Let's just say it was Tony. <laughs> it was probably GoFo. Probably GoFo. He's the only one that does these things. <laughs> okay. I am not expecting this to be a good tame. I really don't mind. And I just want to get it tamed so we can use this for the Faso. Oh, sweet. We'll catch you in a few hours then, Ben. Nice, man. We still need to go do the last cave as well. Get the last artifact. 
all righty let's let's call this one let's give it a name though let's give it a name let's call it oh it's actually kind of black black and like blue-ish let's call it I'm gonna call it sprint so i know what it's meant for it's gonna be bait okay now let's see got my grenades maybe i should go get some med brews maybe i should go get some med brews Let's go get some med brews. My food. And maybe I'll fill up and take one more canteen. So we do not want to run out of water along the way. That's maybe a good idea. Help me think here, guys. Help me think here. Help me think here. Help me think here. I want to be fully prepared. So I've got some narcotics. I actually do have more. We can take more. We've got narco got narcotics to keep it asleep. I've got the grenades. 33 grenades. I've got some med brews. My armor is still kind of okay. Shotgun. We've got the saber. Maybe sleeping bags. Very high melee damage for a saber. Let me see. 277. Hey, Cap. What's happening? How you doing? Thank you so much. Yeah, no, this is just... He's just going to be bait. That's all he's going to be for now. We'll take another cryopod. What else? So we're going to walk up to it. We're going to... You know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to take this off. Actually going to take this off. Let's take my ghillie. Yeah, we're going to wear the, the ghillie I have. Normal ghillie. Okay. Yeah, it's it's easier said than done, Tattoo. It's easier said than done. Some of those salt nodes are too far. On your way to the next one, you'll lose um, the taming progress. And if you if the bar runs out, you have to completely start over. But if you get dismounted you can jump back on with exactly the same taming progress that's what some of these other youtuber guys are not telling you i can probably leave my gun and the darts i don't think we'll need that probably leave this yeah let's just make a few sleeping bags grab some fiber I think this is my hide barrel. Oh, that's fiber barrel. The hide barrel. Sleeping bugs. Let's make three. Sup, Lee? How you doing? How's things going, buddy? Okay. So... We're gonna go to Yardley. I think I've got everything I need. I think I got everything that we need. Let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna go that way, actually. So there's this little spot. I went around flying around the map. And there's a little spot where... I don't know how it's gonna work. We're gonna have to check it. Let me make sure if I need a male or a female. I got a couple of salt nodes. That's hopefully close enough 
to each other for me to go between them. Hopefully they're close enough. We'll see. Okay, I just want to make sure if I need a female or a male. Kind of got mind wiped there. I need a female, guys. Remember me. I need a female. <laughs> Remind me. Remind me I need a female. Okay, let's go see what we got. This way. Okay. Let the pain begin. This is going to be terrible. <laughs> Cap, you need a female. Thanks, Cap. <laughs> uh, good sense of humor there, man. Good sense of humor. Well, at least now I can see the chat every time and go, I need a female. <laughs> gotta say these easter colors are actually really nice i like the colors of some of the the dinos um the thorny dragons especially holy crap some of these thornies are beautiful not a big fan of thorny dragons but i went actually and tamed one or two just for the colors they're crazy you need a female <laughs> ah guys now i'm gonna hear it every 10 seconds you need a female <laughs> Thanks, boys. I appreciate that. Good job. Good job. Great teamwork. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's look for a female. Female needed. That's it. Okay, here we are in the desert, boys. How far am I from my little marker over there? Ooh, wait. This one here. Let me just see. Wild male. Ah, this one can go. In fact, let me help these bad boys quickly. All right, vultures. Never mind. Most needed the female. <laughs> okay. All right, I got it, guys. I got it. I got it. I, got it. I don't think I'm gonna forget now. <laughs> uh, funny bunch. But I love it. I love it. Love the team spirit. Okay. So there's one here. And there's a little node here, but this is too far. This might be too far, unless I go from... Unless I start at this one, hit that one, and then go to the next one. This could work. This could very well work. This could very well work. I wonder if I can... You guys think I can flap him out like this? <laughs> you can't burn them up with the wave in. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that. Male 140. Jeez Louise. No shame. Ah, don't start. Don't start. Don't start that. <laughs> you will actually confuse me. It's a female. It's the one that Cap said first. Female. 
No, my God, you guys are gonna confuse the crap with me. I know what you guys are gonna do right now. I'm watching you, boys. Gonna have me guess here. Do I need a mail? Then I tame, end up taming the wrong one. Get back home, and then it's not what I needed. <laughs> It's time time! Jobba, how are you doing, buddy? Wait, this one? This one, too? There we go. What do we got here? Wild mail. I bet you boys you didn't know that you can burn them under the ground with a fire weapon. That's what we're here for. That's what we're here for. To give you all these super tippets and things that you've never known or seen anywhere else. But here on the Solo Zero Gaming Channel. Also gonna have to get it over here first. I mean technically I don't need to have a high level female. My male was 125. So I can actually just get any female. So where's this malware? Oh my uh, it's a female, boys. It's a female. It could be this one. Could she be the lucky gal? Let's set her on fire and see. Wild male. <laughs> oh, no. This view much Yeah, it does! Oh, it actually does look like Ragnarok! Yeah, you're absolutely right. It does look a little bit like Rag. We were talking about it a little bit last night. I'm wondering how the underworld on the center is going to look like. A female 10! Oh, I'm not taming a level 10. Well, she's dead anyway, so... Okay, well, let's not put in the points into the melee damage just yet. Java, when are we adding you to the tribe? Female 115. This is the one, boys. This is the one. Ow. Alright, let's lure this one a little bit closer to where I kind of want it. A little bit this way. Oh, please don't die to that author blurer now. Please don't do that. Don't do that. Alright, you got him. Come this way. Come this way, buddy. Yes, okay, so we got a female. We got a female. It's 115 female, boys. Not a bad level. It's gonna take gazillions and gazillions of ages, but we shall get it there. I am slowly not luring it to where I want it to go. Can I pick it up with a waven? We cannot. Okay, well. Any death worms? Yeah, even Alpha. We found quite a few death worms. That's how we tamed the mantis. Wait, what? Who be you? Well. Oh snap. 
getting sandwiched. Come on, buddy. Follow me this way. That's it. That's it. Bring it this way. I need to take you just a little bit more. Come on. Let me, let me give some inspirational words here to get her to follow me. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. That's it. Maybe you want to take a bite? That's, I suppose, good enough. Keep that aggro. You can do it. Take a bite. Take a nip. No? You don't want to? It's kind of boring. Okay, so let's do this. Is she gonna go all the way back? <laughs> What's even the point of luring them away if they just run all the way back? Wait. Ah. How about if I land? Okay, the aggro is still there. Let's just drop the aggro. This is actually working. I'm I'm kind of slowly pulling her to where I want her to go. This is perfect. Come on, take it, take a bite, take a bite, you can do it. No, not a stun, take, take a bite, take a bite. That's it, okay, now let's go. That is good. I want her to go to that little oasis over there, because there's an entire line of little salt nodes that I'm kind of going to pull her to. And a whole bunch of vultures and stuff that can potentially cause havoc. Right, let's kill this. see the disappointment on my face why is you running back that way come back here oh no yes 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 don't run all the way just fight these scorpions like maybe i can help you kill one how am i gonna do that oh please don't kill her now i'm gonna be so disappointed shy <laughs> that's one word for it all right that is definitely one word for it Now we gotta just wait. She's, I'm not gonna lure her there. So we're gonna have to. 
make our way like this maybe like that then go to that one okay there she goes ducks underneath the sand Here we go, here we go. Let the pain begin. I should make it to that rock. I should be able to make it to this rock. Let's see. Okay, boom. Rock made. And now, I hope I make it to this salt node. <laughs> Let's go. Right, here we go, here we go. Boom! Okay, we're slowly getting there. We are slowly getting there, boys. <laughs> Painful experience. There's one right there. Imagine that's a female. I'm gonna crap in the pants, I swear. Alright, we need to hit every little salt node there is here. Every little one. Is that all of them? Okay, now we're gonna move on to the next one. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, here's the next one. Yo, Venus, what's up? How are you doing? Zema? How's things going? <gasps> no, 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 no! Ooh. What? Wow, I mean, I didn't even know that's possible. Let's take a node while we're taming a dino. <laughs> oh shit, boys, you know what I just realized? I didn't put down a single sleeping bag, not one. Taming them and getting the nodes. What can I say? What can I say? This is actually going pretty well. Way better than my first night. But you see, I planned this. I actually went and I planned a route. And said, I'm going to go from this one to this one. And if I can get it here. So it's all in the planning, guys. It's all in the planning. I don't know if I'm going to reach the next one, though. I don't think I'll reach the next one. I do not know if I'm going to reach the next one. Uh, we might not reach the next one. Oh shit. Where is the next one? No, go that way, go that way, go that way. This one just down there. This one just down there, I'm going to run out. Oh, it's barrier. Oh, no. Well, that sucks. Oh, 
shit. Ah, oh, shit. Now the storm got me. I'm gonna have to start all of that over. I went the wrong way. Crap. I might have just lost all of that taming, we'll have to start over. Because I ran out of time. I don't know Java, if you run out of time, you lose all the taming progress. Yeah, I just went the wrong way, I didn't go the right way. I should actually go and make markers on the map, that's what I should have done. This one, to this one, to this one, to this one. Yes, there's a, there's a bar that runs out Venice, and if you don't hit a rock in a certain time, then the bar runs out, and you have to start over. But we'll get it, we'll get it, we'll get it. If I can find it again. Because now obviously we're having a massive storm here. Is that the one? That's the lady. Okay, so there she goes. Let me cry out this bad boy. Take a grenade. Oh, the storm's a pain in the ass. Hey, go away now, storm. Go away now. Okay, storm's over. Right, let's go. I'm gonna have to head somewhere that way to go hit rocks now. Here's the one I was looking for. And I didn't! I didn't lose it! Fantastic! Nice! Alright, we didn't lose it. Okay, cool, 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 cool. See, there's a bar that says control, the green bar. That gives you time to hit another rock or anything except hard soil then you get dismounted all right so the next one is in that way all righty we got this boys we got this gonna be taming this bad boy Ooh. see that one and then a little bit that way is another one now, I'm hoping I've got enough, enough control, enough control to make it here. And there is not a single stone here. There's one, there's one, there's one. Ooh, lifesaver. Okay, lifesaver. I'm gonna have to make my way around like that and then out to that node.
Okay, here we go. Let's hit some of these rocks. There's actually quite a few of these rocks over here. That is a gorgeous Anki. <laughs> Holy crap. Look at that. That is beautiful. I love the blue. Yeah, it's a bit hard to control as well. I'm trying to kind of get it where I want it to go. Come on, come on. We need to maybe hit this one and then see if we can find that salt node. Oh, I got dismounted. Okay, so this is where the saber comes into play. Quick escape. Whew. Okay, there we go. It's not aggro to me anymore. Let's just see where this oasis is. So it's just behind this dune. Then I'll see it. Let's keep our eye on that one. It just needs to go into the ground again. I can't see her. Where did she go? Yo, where are you running to? Chasing the kangaroo! That's not good. But what? Oh, the vulture. We just have to patiently wait. I hope the vulture doesn't kill it. Dung beetle. <laughs> this thing's on a rampage. Go under the ground. Go, 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 go. That's it. That's it. Go to the sand. Go take a nap. Sleepy, sleepy under the sand. You can do it. Oh no! Why are you going for the snake? What?
Are you going for the snake? Don't go for the snake. Let's see. That's still the right one, right? Yes. Luckily, they don't lose that torpor that fast. Imagine if they did. That would be a pain in the butt cheeks. Here go, go, go. Sleepy, go. Do it. Under the sand. Go for it. You can do it. Yes. Yes. Yes, go. Can you do it there? You can do it there. I'm sure you can do it there. <laughs> Words of encouragement. Yeah, boy, we can. Nice. Okay, now. My saber has taken damage. What? Saber, please don't do this now. Thank you so much. Yeah, let's go. Okay, we need to get over that hill. <sighs> Stop going this way. That way, go that way, go that way, go that way, go that way. That's it, that's it, that's it. Let's go this way. Then we'll hit a couple of these stones here. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. That's it. Okay, now we go over. Oh, man, I hate it when it does that. That turning thing it does is crazy. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. This way, buddy. <laughs> no! You are wasting so much time. Oh my greatness. Don't go this way. Do not go this way. Oh. Woo. Close call. Your kids now say everything is a pain in the butt cheeks. <laughs> ah, fun times. <laughs> Glad I could help, Venus. Glad I could help. Pain in the butt cheeks. Yeah, don't don't be aggressive. Calm, calm down. Take a casual stroll through the desert. Let me kill the pink snake. Reminds me, let's put down a sleeping bag. Okay. Yes. No. Oh, fantastic. Okay, now we just need to cry on my little tipper. What a process. What a process. And I'm out of water, actually. One canteen was not enough. One canteen was not enough. This way. Let's go. Is that sleeping bag? Okay, so here we got some more of these uh, salty pieces. And of course, we're gonna hit the building and we're gonna get dismounted because, because we just gotta.
That was kind of sucky. Yeah, that was kind of sucky. Not gonna lie. That was kind of sucky. Oh crap. Oh crap. We need one stone. One stone. Come on. 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 What? Who's that? <laughs> what is that? It's, it can't break that? How does that work? What is this thing? I am so confused right now. Is that an unbreakable stone? Okay. We are not even halfway yet. Let's see how this goes. Do these bones work? Let's just see. Okay, that was actually a... Yeah, I think the bones work as well. You think stealing e eggs with a moth was hard? <laughs> no, Venus. There are things way harder than that. Like this. It's actually not hard. It is just very, very time consuming and like a serious pain in the butt cheeks. Wait until the mega shalom comes out, man. That thing is even worse. Yeah, it's very slow. And of course, for some reason, it's so freaking hot. I'm just losing all the water I have. That's another one of the non-breakable ones. Okay, there's an oasis there. Let's see if this bone works. Yeah, the bones work too, actually. That one didn't. So some bones work, not all of them. <laughs> oh no, come on. We need it to rain. I need it to rain. I'm gonna run out of water very soon. A 60 second cooldown on the cryo. Why do I even bother? No. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Very tedious. Very tedious, Java. Very tedious. But we can do it. We're halfway now, I think. We are halfway, boys. If I can cryo this freaking thing. If anybody knows how to put this off, 
Jeez, guys. Just let me know. This is the stupidest thing ever. That you have to wait 60 seconds before you can cryo your dino. Right, let's go. We are halfway. We are halfway. Okay, there's some rocks over here, and then I'm gonna zip back into the desert to see if we can get some of those salt nodes again. Okay, let's hope this little oasis has got something for us. Yes, it does. Fantastic, fantastic. It does, does, does. Just these trees, get rid of these trees. Right, let's turn around. Let's hit this one. Okay, good, good, good. There's one more. It's actually another one. Right, let's hit this one from this. Oh, there's two more. Nice. Might get dismounted here. Oh, snap. That is the... I'm standing on top of it. Yo, boys, I got this. Oh, that's a grenade. That's not my saber. Come on, let's go. Healy broken. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't, don't follow me. Don't follow me. It's bad. It's not good. Not good. Go eat the scorpion. That's it. Okay, it looks like there's an oasis just behind there, but we'll have to hit some of the rocks. Guys. The pain and suffering. <laughs> it's unreal. There it goes, there it goes. My only worry is I'm going to be out of water. I need more water. Guys, is there anybody on the base that can bring me some water? Maybe one or two canteens or glass bottles or jars or anything. Let's go. Okay, there's a lot of rocks here. Let's just hit some rocks for now. What? Morrison, I am at 2614. 2614. We are just, just over halfway. Oh, look at that mantis. Oh, that thing is beautiful. <laughs> we can do this. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. slowly do this I 
I can't take it up the mountain. The minute it goes onto hard rock surface, it can't be under the ground anymore. It comes out. That's how it dismounts you. You have to kind of stay in an area where it's sort of sandy. We're doing pretty well, actually. We're doing pretty well, guys. We are doing pretty well. That's what I'm doing. I'm kind of mounting alongside the desert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Don't come this way. See? Rocky surface. And we get dismounted. Oops, no, no, no. Woo. Okay, let's not pull it too far from this area. That was a good area. That was a good area. That was a good area. Great area, actually. I'm right next to the trench, guys. There's a purple drop at the end of the trench. 2214. 2214. If anybody can bring me some water. Yes, yes, yes. I see you. I see you. I see you. Look this way. To your left. To your left. I can see you. Just stand still. Okay, I will give you my empty ones. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're a lifesaver, Morrison. Yes. Yeah, you can't, like, I can't take it up the mountain there. It doesn't go, it has to be in the sand. But you can go along the sides, though. Okay. This was actually a good area. Lots of stones and rocks and... These bones. Fantastic, boys. We almost got this one. We almost got it. We are this close. This close. Watch me hit a rock golem. <laughs> that would be kind of funny. Hit a rock golem. Oh. There's just so much animals and stuff here. It's gonna be hard to protect it. No, I'm just gonna get dismounted. I'm gonna get dismounted. Don't go this way. Don't go this way. Do not go this way. Please don't go this way. Go that way, go the other way. Yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. Oh, crap. Out, go out. Yes. Oh, shit. Let's get it away from all of that shit. All right. Now run up this hill. Gonna wait for it. Okay, cool, Morrison. You can land there. I'll give you the canteen back later. Thank you so much, Morrison. You're the best. Thanks, man.
Ooh, she's looking a little bloody. No, she's going. She's fine. Just don't let her aggro on you now. Okay, cool. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we are this close, boys. We are this close. Shit. Fucking vulture. Go down, go down, go down. This area is a bit safer as well. It actually looks like we might hit... I might be able to come hit some of these bones and then go down to the rocks again. That could work. That could maybe work. Yep, boys, there we go. The saber has been a lifesaver. I'm a poet and I don't even know it. Let's go. I'm gonna go for these bones. Let's see how much we get with these bones. We got a little bit to go. Just a little bit. They seem to do just as much as the salt nodes. Maybe even a little bit more. We are so close. <laughs> we are so close. <laughs> you, we are so close. And I don't want to go into an area with all kinds of shit. So let's just go back here. See if we can slowly make our way past all these dinos. Kind of hit a safer, slightly safer area. I've got a clear. Where's here, Morrison? I don't know where it's clear. You need to ping for me. We kind of went off track. Man, we are close to... This thing is so close to knockout. Just not here. Not here. Don't do it here. Oh no, it's going to get knocked out here. Only dragons are not that bad. This looks like a good, good spot. This could be a good spot, boys. Not so many Carnos, not so many Scorpions. I guess this is the spot. And I got it. I got it. It's knocked out. <laughs> yes, we got it. Now to keep it safe. Now to keep it safe quickly. Let's eat everything around me. Louise. Oh, no, 
right, that should kind of do. That should kind of do. <laughs> yes, you guys. That was a mission and a half. And there she goes. Look at that. It's not the color one, but at least it's a 115. It's a good female for the male I have. Good start. Great start, actually. Definitely a great start. We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Don't eat the snakes and the orgies and the stuff yet, Morrison. Don't eat them. I'm gonna leave them alive until the food drops a little bit. And then we'll put some food into this bad boy. Yeah, so I'm just gonna wait a little bit until the food drops and then I'll start feeding. Are you bringing me prime? Thank you so much, man. Okay, let me put it in here so it doesn't spoil that fast. Are you tame it? So that was just the knockout process, Cap. Now we have to keep it asleep. It still has a torpor bar, so we'll use narcotics. And then I'm just going to put prime in it. That's all I'm going to do. I'm just going to put prime in it. Yeah, don't eat those things now. Leave them. Let's leave them. If I need more, I can eat them a little bit later. Oh, that is beautiful. These colors are just absolutely fantastic. Look at this thing. That was pretty. It's very pretty. Holy crap! We did it. Oh no, there's a storm incoming. Do I have any silk on me? Probably don't have a single silk. Well then. <laughs> okay. I guess we're gonna just sit and weather the storm on the waven. So they've got a stun with their tail. They've got a stun. It's a three second stun. Every time they bite something, it reduces that thing's armor, which means every bite they do more damage. A lot like the car car. Um, they're very good swimmers. Actual like in water, not just sand. They are actually very good swimmers. A couple of things they're really good at and you can shoot off it. It's a go-to on this map. Yeah. Ah, we're good, we're good. There's lots of stuff here I can feed it. Lots of RGs. Morrison was here. I think, I don't know who that is. Lightning Waven. It's at least a tamed one. Uh... Yeah, you can bring me a saddle, Vixen. You can bring me a saddle. Then we can ride around a bit of it and show people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be nice. Thanks for the help, Morrison. Oh man, that was fantastic. Like, lots of help, boys. I really appreciate the help, guys. Teamwork is the dream work.
Let's just make sure this baby is still alive and still sleeping. What's her food on? She is on. Food is dropping slowly. Very, very, very slowly. Storms are incredible. I just love them. It is crazy how realistic they've gotten it. It's insane, actually. It looks so freaking cool. Craziness. And look up, and then boom, gone. And then it just waves over. Crazy, boys, crazy. Right, let's quickly set this Arthro on fire. Because everybody likes a little bit of toasted Arthro. Yes, please. With a little bit of bacon and eggs in the morning. I added bacon there for you, Java. Gotcha, buddy. I gotcha. 7-7. Seven, seven. This is basically 7-800. Peace. The food is dropping so slowly. Don't forget sausages. Which kind? Water, which kind? Which kind of sausages do you want? With your eggs in the morning. And the toast. A little bit of jam. And ham, yes, see, you guys are going full English farmhouse breakfast here. A little bit of mushrooms. Hmm, that could actually be quite nice now. A nice little breakfast like that, even though it's evening, but still, it's delicious. Now, all of this is gonna spoil. Well, let me do this. I'm actually gonna take this. I'm gonna put it in him. We can uh, start the taming process. And then let's quickly go eat the snake over there. Three more pieces. Freshly new three pieces. There we go. Almost done. Done. Boom. Shiki room room room. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. There she is. HP 5500, stamina 15, has a lot of stam, oxygen, food, weight, melee 272. Oh, I got a Therizino saddle in that drop? That's freaking cool. Alright, boys, let's go grab a saddle. And then I'll show you guys how this thing plays around with. You're on your way with the saddle? Alright, then I'm gonna wait right here. Then I shall be waiting right here. You just finished pancakes? Oh, Java, I'm guessing you had maple syrup on it. It's actually quite cool how the map looks. They've done a spectacular job with with this map. It looks fantastic. Scorch is never my favorite map of mine, but the more I play on it, the more it kind of grows on me, the more I'm starting to like it. 
Hey, Dojo, how you doing? Aim? What's up, man? Are you on the stream? Fruit Pat, just pop an in, say hi, and leave a like. Ah, oh, Fruit, you're awesome. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I hope everything is going well with you. You should come and join us at some time. I'll bolt it down a little bit. I've got like four or five open slots for someone to move into. You know what I mean. Build a nice house for us. We still need a boxing ring. A bank. Here we go. Thank you so much. Okay, let's cryo this thing out. And cryo that one. So what I'll do is let's let's do this. Let's make my way home. On the Faso. Yeah, let's do that. No, that's all good, Vixen. Thank you so much for your kindness in bringing me a saddle. <laughs> I didn't know how else to say that. Okay, so it's got a stun. Whoops. That should actually technically stun now, but sometimes it doesn't. Maybe it's because that thing has got that. Let's stun something else. Let's go stun. Not. A... We've got a floating rock golem. <laughs> What's he doing? Ah, yeah, he's cool. Let's stun this. Let's stun. Let's stun the thorny dragon. Boom. Okay, that didn't work. Yeah. And then obviously we can do this. Let's make my way home. Let's go around to the river and then we'll swim up the river all the way. Seems like this is a bit faster than walking. Crazy though, crazy, crazy stuff. And some outlaws to rob the bank. <laughs> yeah. New job! Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool fruit. What's the what's the new occupation? What's your new job? If you want to share it with us, you don't have to, but if you want to, what you doing? Change is like a holiday, guys. Sometimes it's good. Maybe just what you need. Holy crap, I can't believe I actually tamed one again. So here we go. We got a female. Or the male. Now Tony is gonna go... Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so if you're out of stamina... Then it will bring you back out. Where's that rubber? This one? Let me see. Uh, I actually want to go in by this one. Follow the river road and then like that. So let's go to that river. Seems like nothing aggro's on it. Seems like nothing aggro's on it. So it's a bit like the rhino of the swamp. It's like 
the king of the sand or the desert, I suppose. You put it like that. So now we need to make our way in here somehow. Maybe around the corner here. Here we go. Jeez, you up. HP and stamina quite a bit, actually. <gasps> Wait, what? So if I don't move and I don't touch it, it actually just goes into the sand? <laughs> Look at that. So what, what does that do? Very cool. Okay, cool. That's pretty cool news. I'm glad for you, Fruit. I'm very happy for you. That's awesome. And I really mean it when I say it. Like, I really do. Ah, uh, okay. So once it hits the water, it kind of just comes out. Can I go in here? Cannot bury here. Cannot bury here. Do you think it's for the heat wave, my son? It could be. Yeah. I didn't even think about that. I'll test it. We'll see when the next heat wave hits. I'll jump onto it and then go see what it does. But as soon as you hit the water, it comes out. Yeah, it doesn't like the water. <laughs> but it's also a very, very cool swimmer. Like, I'm not even kidding. This thing can swim. Yo, guys. How blue is this water? Is this just not amazingly beautiful? This is fantastic. Look at this thing swim. Swims faster than he swims in the sand. Oh shit. Okay, so raw golems still aggro though. But the sabers doesn't... Yeah, look at that. So nothing else aggro's on it, except the raw golems, which means gigas and car cars will aggro on it too. The bigger stuff. And it's a flint farmer of note, apparently. This is this is amazing. This is so beautiful. Like this is incredibly beautiful. Let's see if we holy shit, that is one big fish. Holy crap. Look at this thing. <laughs> yes. This thing is humongous. Okay, so now we are gonna go that way. Yeah, let's go that way. Kinda wanna show you guys what it swims like and there's this one deep pool that I want to go into.
Pack of wolves. Nothing. No aggro. And here's the town. Now oh, let's go take a swim in the lake. I might have to... Ah, uh, this is the... Basically the bottom end of the town. Holy crap guys, we've built a beautiful town here. This is amazing. I love this town. Okay, let's go take a swim here and see what it does. I hope it's deep enough. It should be. Let's grab some stamina. Is it? Oh, it's not. It's just not. Oh, it's just not big enough. Okay, but there's another one over here. Maybe we'll go there quickly. No, it can't pull a wagon. No. No, it doesn't have the space for the wagon. So which one of these two is actually the bigger? Is it the one by Java there or this one? Let's go check out the one where Java built his little house. But I think it's so cool that nothing aggro's on you. Alright, let's see. Not deep enough? It's not deep enough. <laughs> Hello, Java. How are you doing, Java? <laughs> Alright, guys. It's not deep enough. Yeah, finally got it. Finally got the Faso. Where can we... I don't think there's any wave that's deep enough for this thing to swim. It's a bit big. It's a little big. I might have to go and get some meat to quickly feed my babies. Let's grab the mail. Alright, let's put the grenades down. Grenades, 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 grenades. No? No grenades? Okay, we'll put the grenades up here. my mid bruise away i'll come and put that away in a second back let's quickly go put this in the community vaults over here we've got armor weapons 
Mastercraft. Okay, that's... No one's gonna use that. I don't think anyone's gonna use that. Use that one there. Canteens, that's my saber. What Victor Mun do? Now, let's throw these bad boys out and let's make a baby. Let's make a faso baby. Burry. Ah. Right. Allow special attacks. It's got special attacks. Oh, it's tailspin. The 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 knock. Cave Red Obi Zeus. I did. We went to the Oasis uh, cave in yesterday's stream. Man, they are fantastic swimmers. I was looking for one now, but it's a bit far. Okay. Our first Paso breed on the server. Welcome to the stream, Zeus. Where are you from? These things are actually pretty cool. I like that you can shoot off their back. I'm thinking we might actually do the Manticore with these guys. We might just go and do the Manticore. And I'm going to tell you why. We can use shotguns off its back and shoot the manticore while he's flying. We can go under the ground when the manticore throws his sleeping gas. And you can sail away from the rock golems and the other stuff. And the saddles are full up at the moment. I think we've got some pretty decent blueprints and things. Now the question is, is it going to be an egg? Or is it going to be... Not an egg. You from Greece? No way, Zeus. <laughs> That's pretty cool, man. Welcome to the stream, man. So I got this thing that I add people where they're from. I've got a list of countries that I just updated today. And we are on 37 countries, guys. 37. Greece would make it. 38 yeah so one day i'd like to have a subscriber from every country in the world like a little goal i have ah oh, it's an egg nice so that would be 38 then that's pretty sweet yay who's over is this guys don't leave your pets here i'm gonna take this i'm gonna take this away if you're leaving your pets here i'm gonna take this away don't leave your pets there. Poor Tony. <laughs> House is like a zoo. Okay, let me try out these guys quickly. I wonder what blueprints we got and how much time is that egg gonna... Is that Zemas? <laughs> you brought them from the island. 14 minutes. Are these your island uh, over Zema? Alright, let me quickly just see what blueprints we have. Armor, weapon, battle blueprints over here. Ascendant. Ah, so, see, look at that. Crafting character with that saddle, boys, and it's not that expensive. 7,000 hide is not that expensive. We can easily make 18, 17 of these saddles. Crafting character, you'll get at least 200, 200 armor. We're gonna do Manticore with Fasos, I'm telling you guys. Double ear infection. Yo, that's not good, Zimmer. 
you are extremely unlucky the other day you had the rona virus now double ear infection extremely unlucky it's allowed in the boss fight it should be i can't see why not it should be i mean i can imagine that this won't be allowed <laughs> yeah manticore will just throw an entire island at you yeah i don't think this is going to be allowed but the faso should be allowed we'll have to taste it i'll have to taste it yeah we'll have to taste it but i think it's gonna be i think it will be La, 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 la. what's up buddy how you doing pro golems i've always loved them they are such cool creatures anything bigger than a rex isn't hey wait super heat super heat let's grab the faso uh Let's see. We might have to quickly... Let's go run somewhere where we can actually feel the heat. It'll probably be up here. No? Maybe this way. Good time for testing, boys. For science! There we go. Okay, we got super heat here. Still super heat. Let it go down. Let's see. No. Okay, so it does nothing against super heat. Nah, it does nothing against super heat. That would have been cool though. I mean, I feel like because this is a, a sand dino, they should have done that. Yeah, I feel they should have. That would have been actually pretty cool. Your oxygen drops as well, yes. But I mean, you can just wear a, an oxygen tank. 10 minutes on the egg. 10 minutes on the egg. Okay, so it does not cover you from the superheat. Very interesting. Very, very, very interesting. Do I have poly? Did I bring any organic poly? It should probably all be expired by now. Might have to go get some quickly. I want to fix my ghillie suit. I did take a bite or two from the faso, as you can see. I'll just have to fix my gilly. And then we are ready again. How long did it take me, guys? How long did it take me to tame the Faso? Was it an hour? I think it was an hour. One hour. Maybe more? Hour and, say, 15 minutes? Because we are on two hours streaming now. So it's about an hour. Hour and 15 minutes, I believe. One point five, an hour and a half. It's insane, man. It's insane. Thanks, Java. We got space on here again. And I think I just picked up the egg as well. We'll drop it out. There we go. Be longer if my helpers didn't show. 
<laughs> yeah, I, I would have probably, but what I would have done is I would have put a sleeping bag, killed myself, spawned there, so it would have taken about five or ten minutes longer, yeah. Ah, if they're standing over here, it's okay. I just don't want anything on here because everybody drops their eggs here. So if you guys leave the dinos here, it's a bit of a problem. And also, Shay, man, this is Tony's house. Everybody always leaves dinos out here in front. And I mean, it's a, I know it's a good open space. But rather come put your dinos over here. That's it. That's it. Like this. Mellow, yellow, and viper. There's plenty of space here, guys. Come put your dinos over here. I even put a feeding trough here for them. Which is empty, by the way. Whoever's dinos this is. Yo, Vixen! Did you guys end up getting a top off, Vixen? Yeah, I think the next town will build this, the egg hatchery, away from everybody's house. Then if people grow their babies there, then it's not like in front of someone's house. Because if Tony comes out here, it's like, boom. <laughs> A million dinos, and that kind of sucks. I mean, that kind of sucks. Don't want that. Sup, aim goat. How you doing, man? How's things going? What? No, why did I pick the egg up? That was dumb. Out of just accidentally press the button. Let's grab my gun. We'll do some shooting while we wait for the egg quickly. Okay. Those are actually bottles, as you can see. <laughs> But they are hard to see, guys. They are really hard to see. Ah, nice thing is they come back, they actually respawn, watch, Tweak. back, come on, lost, bring the lost ones back, Tweak. there's another one, one more, there's the one, and we, uh, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. that's it, seven of them, seven of them, Daniel, welcome back to the stream, man. Really cool, Daniel. Oh, thank you so much, man. I do PvP myself, actually. We play on official PvP. I do sometimes take some of the guys with me, and then we go play. About a month ago, we spent a couple of weeks on PvP. Server, I think it was 2-3... No, wait. 3233, two, three, three, something like that. And the one map on my cluster is PvP. We kind of PvP like the guys from the Monarchy. Uh, fun, good, clean PvP, if I can put it like that, on, on this server. Obviously not when we play on official. But yeah, I enjoy it myself, man. You put a hatchery in your own base for that reason? Yeah, aim goat. But I'm gonna be honest with you, man. It seems like you're not really a tribe member, man. You kind of like doing your own thing. And that's okay. That's okay. I see when you get stuff, you kind of keep it to yourself. Things like that. I'm the solo one here, remember? <laughs> yeah, no, we did good. We did good. This town is looking amazing. Did really well there. We'll probably, I think, once we beat the Manticore, we can still stay here. But 
Forglar, the map Forglar is actually expanding a lot. Those guys are putting a lot of effort into that map. I don't want to take all of us and then go do something like this there, but something different. Um, I don't know what yet. Maybe we'll build in the fantasy zone, do like an Alice in Wonderland, or we'll go to the Redwoods and do like a Robin Hood type of theme, or I have no idea what. But this was very, very, very well done. Guys, did a spectacular job here. One seventy eight, one eighty seven. Come on, two minutes. Two minute dos. Then we'll have the first baby. Keen to see what the stats would be on a baby that's fully grown and imprinted. Because I went and I checked it out a little bit. They can easily get their HP up to 30,000. And with that saddle, 30 to 33,000, that saddle, some shotguns. I think we can do it. We can definitely, definitely do the Manticore gonna be interesting very interesting obviously if they can go into the boss fight we'll have to check that did you go to the station yet not yet java i'm gonna hatch this baby quickly make sure she's got food and then we'll do a flyby with the wavens and check out the stations i think that martin said earlier on the first station of 25 stations is done so we'll go check it out and it's almost night time it is now yes Almost night time. Because he also said we should come and take a look at night. Do I not have any cryos on me? Oh, I got one. There we go. So we can go check out the station at night. Apparently he put in uh, some lights and stuff and it looks really cool. One minute and counting. Now. That's it. 59. 58. It's the final countdown. Yeah, journey. The final countdown. For the egg to hatch. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we have. Uh. <laughs> wow, must be happy to see me. Okay. Seven thousand. Okay. It's got a little purple in it. Journey. No, it's not. Is it journey? Is it journey? Uh, I don't know. Let's throw it out and see. There we go. That's what the, they look as a baby, guys. This is what they look like, like a baby. Oh, look at that face. That is actually such a cute face. <laughs> but it's Europe. That's right, Lee. It's Europe. You're right. It's Europe. It's not Journey. Journey did... Um... I'm gonna tell you now which one they did. The most famous one. Europe. Oh, 
what's that song's name now? I've got the song stuck in my head, but I kind of not, it's not hitting home. All right, let's grab a Waven. Let me show you boys. You know what? It's still a little bit daytime. Yeah, it's still a little bit daytime. Let me throw that out, grow that a little bit. And when it's darkness, we'll uh, go to the train station. Believe in that's the one. That's the one. That's the one. That's the one. Don't stop believing. Gotta hold on to that feeling. Do -do. Man, they are looking so freaking cool, actually. Look at this. He's got these cheekbones. <laughs> that is pretty cute. Holy crap. That is so cute. <laughs> I love the cheekbones. Okay, so what is this? It's a female. Let's call her. Oh, it's a female. Let's call her Cheeky. We'll call her Cheeky. Yes, Lee, you know your music, man, huh? Rocking it like a rock star. Rocking it like a rock star. All right, how much food is in here? And is that feeding prop actually reaching the baby? Yeah, it does. Yeah, more than enough. Now he knew from the start that it wasn't journey. Now Lee Lee knew, he knew, but it wasn't. I don't know why I said yes it was, because it is actually it is Europe. It is Europe. Feels like it's Europe. Actually I'm now now I'm not sure anymore. Is it Europe? Must be Europe. Come on, come on, come on, come on, cheeky. It's <laughs> actually pretty cool. I think that's pretty cool. They look actually so nice. <laughs> look at this teeth. I mean, I don't know what this stuff is, but all babies have got some gwell and slime and stuff coming out their mouth. So I'm just going to take it as you're perfectly healthy. Perfectly healthy. Yeah, Journey has Don't Stop Believing, but Europe has the final countdown. That is true. Yeah. Okay, so be honest. Who is now singing which one of the two songs in their mind? Because you either have the final countdown or you have Don't Stop Believing in your mind. It's a big lizard. It is kind of a big lizard. Big spiky lizard. You got journey? <laughs> Don't stop believing. Hold on to that feeling. Final countdown? <laughs> yeah they are both great songs actually they are both very good songs sometimes i feel like they don't just don't make songs like that anymore but that's those are two pretty really good songs uh If we put this baby in the kangaroo, 
will the kangaroo actually look after it? I'm gonna go borrow Vixen. I'm borrowing a kangaroo from you. I actually need one. Hm? I use that as a bridge. Vixen! I need a roo. Can I borrow one of your roos? Yes, see, you got like a whole bunch of dinos out here. Can I borrow this one? And she's a mommy. I hope you don't mind. I just want to see what happens if we put the baby in it. Uh, how are we going to do this again? How does this work? see yeah there we go whoops <laughs> there we go Gigi, look at that in mommy's pouch now how does this work do i put the meat then in here uh we need to just check this now for science i'm gonna take out cheeky's food put it in here into mommy Fifty, 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 and three. Let's check cheeky. Is cheeky eating? Before anything actually happens to cheeky, let me just grab some food here. Just in case. Just in case. Let's see. Five, three, three. I mean eight, three, three. Let's see if the food goes up. I want to see if the roux actually takes care of the baby. She should, she should actually. Hey, yo, Wisp, what's happening? How you doing? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, it's okay, Zema, no worries. Does she not feed the babies anymore? You got a test tomorrow? What kind of test you got tomorrow, Wisp? I don't... Wait! Did it? No ways. No, it didn't. It just gives bonus to imprinting? Yeah, she doesn't feed the babies. Uh, I'm gonna give it just a little bit more just to see but I don't think she feeds the babies that would have been cool though would have made life so much easier for a couple of babies I do not think that is happening. Yeah, the Maywing was the first one. Maywing was the first one. But I haven't tasted this on ASA at all. You never know what they changed. They might have decided that, hey, maybe we should make the kangaroo... Because one would think that the kangaroo has a pouch. It's got, you know, it's got the baby thing, so... Let's put this back where I found it. Exactly the way I found it. Can I show you where the waven trap is? I'll, I can show you on the map, Zima. I don't want to leave the baby now. So, the waven trench is over here. I would say about there. 
5515. There's a bridge there. Actually, there's three bridges. You can see three bridges. It's one of these. It's over there somewhere. Let's say 5215. 5215. Just fly there along the trench. You'll see it. It's, it's standing there. It's really hard to miss. It's over there. Could be over here as well. Just check this entire trench. Start here at the beginning. And then just w make your way down. It's on, on this side of the trench. This side. It's like over here somewhere. I'm gonna just wait a little bit more. Yes, it's getting late, pretty, it's getting dark late in the game. It's already almost nine o'clock in game and we still have sunlight. If I can put one more stack of meat in the baby, I think I can actually fly away and then we can check out the rail system quickly. Slowly getting there, we're slowly getting there. Alright guys. Let's see what is the squad looking like. Takes a while to get the babies to uh spot where oh man it's gonna take it's gonna take a while to get this baby to eat out of the feeding trough. All right, I'm gonna just fly close by the base, not leave the base area, but let's quickly check out what the railroad looks like. Okay, so here we got the train station. And the rail going that way seems to have been picked up. I'm not sure why. So this is the first station. Yeah, it's looking pretty cool. Looking pretty cool guys. Where does this go? The tunnels under the train. This is kind of nice. Looking very cool, guys. Very cool. This train station is looking very cool. Very cool. Look at that. Holy crap, that looks nice. Oh, Morrison, you did a fantastic job, man. Looks pretty sweet. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. <laughs> that holds a problem. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to go down. I'm gonna have to get my Waven to come to me. Hey, land, buddy.
I got it. I got it, Morrison. I got it. <laughs> yeah. I got lots of HP. Thanks, man. <laughs> it's looking really cool. I appreciate that, Morrison. The train station is looking really cool, man. Looking really, really cool. Alright, let's quickly stop back at the baby. Make sure the baby's got more food. You squirrel! What's up, squirrel? How you doing? Somebody been taming a saber. Sup, cheeky? Cheeky breaky. Is that it? <laughs> they look so cool. Ah, I'm okay, man. Not too bad, squirrel. Not too bad. Just another day in Orc Paradise. What can we say? What can we say? How much food does this baby have? Okay. Let's go grab that drop quickly. I see it's got a halo. The babies are adorable. <laughs> you should see in the daylight, Stephen. It's... They look, it's got little cheekbones. They are pretty cool, man. I want to see if we can quickly grab this drop. And then go back and just feed the baby again. At least this is not too far. But yeah, now we have male and female. Finally. Craziness. It's a baby. <laughs> yeah, it's a baby. The worst pure test tomorrow is an entry exam. Okay. Well, good luck with that, man. Hope you do well. Hope you pass. I hope you studied or do whatever you had to do. Those things are important, buddy. Very important. Like I always say, it's importante. Importante. Yeah, the, the saddles are actually full up on the map. We got a nice blueprint. I picked up a nice saddle and I see there's still a couple of saddles in the vault. So, they are definitely full up, which is nice. My plan is, jeez. Let me just grab this drop quickly. So, my plan is to actually start breeding them a little bit and then use them for the Manticore fight. I want to go do the Manticore with them. I think it's possible. It'll be something different. I've never done the Manticore with the Faso because we've never had a Faso before. So it's gonna be cool. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be really, really cool. Okay, so now while well, it's night time, now it's proper night time. Let's check out that train station. Let me grab this this drop here and then we can quickly check the train. Let's see what the lights look like. Bullets and cactus broth. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna try it. Definitely. There's a couple of cool things that they can do. I think that will help in the Manticore fight. Marson, here's an idea. 
maybe put a couple of lights on the roof on the outside as well oh that does look really good though that does look really nice these lights make a huge difference i love it yeah it looks very cool man very good job martin One train station. Come show you something. Okay, but I've got the baby out, so I don't want to stay too long. Let me quickly run back in. I got me baby. The baby. <laughs> What's up? What you got? Where are you taking me? Do I need a gun for this? This looks like secret meetings. Ah, oh, this is where the generator is. Okay. No gun needed. <laughs> you guess that where the power comes from. Sweet man. It's like the secret tea party meeting. All right, let's go feed the baby. Why? I just wish they would fix this untracking thing. Everybody's wavens just standing everywhere. <laughs> Looks pretty cool. Like it. I kind of like it. All right, cheeky. How much food you got in you? Ah, oh, we getting there. Nice, nice, nice. Can't wait for the center. Ah, oh, there's still lots to do on Scorch, man. There is still so much to do on Scorch. I'm kind of still happy, but yeah, I think the center's going to be cool. But I don't know if it's going to be... To be honest, I don't know if it's going to be as cool as... As Scorch Earth. After you've played... On this map. And that's my experience now. The other maps kind of feel a bit easy. This map really makes things a little hard. Keeps it very interesting. You used to use the OV Raptors? <laughs> yeah. Fly in with a Pterodon or an RG, throw them out of the cryo or carry them there, and then they pick up the egg, bloop, and then you pick up the OV and you fly out. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. There's lots of ways you can do it, man. Lots of ways you can do it, but there is nothing wrong with doing it that way. Absolutely nothing wrong with doing it like that. And there we go. Marshall has got his clothes back on. I should actually paint my clothes a little bit. What kind of paint do I have? Do I have green and red? Might have to go make some paint. We got some red, but we don't have green. So let's paint my clothes quickly. Feed the baby. Paint the clothes. You can, Stefan. You can still do it on Scorch Earth. Why can't you do it? Don't you have OV Raptors that you can bring over from the island? Take you all quickly. We'll take you all, go smack some berries, come back. And then I'm gonna make a whole bunch of paint, guys. If you want paint, there's gonna be lots of paint now, but 
Please do not paint the town. I mean, it's a western. Booby! Hey, you're a big fan. Oh. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that, man. Thank you so much. Where are you from? Oh, okay. So you... Okay. We kind of did the same. We started the fresh year. We didn't bring anything over. Well, some of us didn't bring stuff over. But I mean, I don't mind. Each to his own, you know? So, uh... We do kind of the same at the moment. I'm doing the same at the moment. I've got a really big base on the island. And I've got a spectacular base. It's probably the best base I've ever built. My own personal base on Ford Lar. Right, let's put all of this in here. Alrighty then, so I shall be taking these ones and I shall be taking these ones and maybe these ones. Where's the golden color? Gold coloring. Cool. You're from Canada. Nice. Nice man. Cool, cool, cool. Welcome. Wait, is that there's a dino that can hold other dinos and have a base on it? Are you talking about the Mosa? Wisp? Which dino are you talking about? Ice Age map? Uh, no, I actually didn't, Stephen. I really didn't. Are you on our Discord, Stephen? If you're on a Discord, feel free to send me a link, man. Show me what this Ice Age map is. I haven't seen it. Have not seen it. Been following Fordlar a lot. It's a very beautiful map. Very beautiful map. Okay, so I'm gonna stand here in the jailhouse quickly. Actually, let's stand towards the light like that. Cool. Okay, now let's paint. Let's paint my shirt. Paint my shirt. I didn't take red. Why didn't I take red? Is there no red? Did it just make pink? Can you see? Is there no reds? Ah, oh, yes, the reds. Cool. It's about 75% uh, Okay, like most of the other maps at the moment Okay, cool, yeah, put some screenshots for me Let's see what it looks like, man If it's pretty cool, we can, we can make a plan Let's see Gore Red Burning Scab Let's just take normal red Okay. And then we'll take green. What do we have here? Emerald. Yeah, that looks better. That actually looks better. Then we can do the yellow scarf, which I kind of like. Cool, cool, cool. 
shoes. We make the shoes like a more red color. Nice. That's dark red. That looks good. Let's do let's do that with the gloves as well. That looks pretty cool. Alright, now my belt. Are we doing the same dark color on the belt? Yeah, let's do that. Fantastic. And then... Pants. Actually, I like the pants, the color they are. Let's see what it looks like if we do this. I want that to be something else. Let's see what that looks like. That looks pretty cool. I like it. <laughs> Ice Age is always called Mord Map. Ah, if it's always called, we can do like a Viking theme or something, you know? There's lots we can do, guys. Lots. If you think about it, think about it this way. If you've got a group of people working together like we do, and it's my server, we can technically do anything. Anything we want to. What the? <laughs> What's your ideal stats for Rexes to do the Gamma Manticore? Your own official? I would say minimum 33,000 HP. Minimum. Don't go more than 35. I, th between 33 and 35 is about the HP. 33, I, I think, is a good number. 33, if you can, do 35, but then don't go more into HP. Um, that's a very difficult one, though. Melee damage is it's difficult because... The only thing your Rexes can really bite is the Death Worms and the Manticore. They're not going to bite the Rock Golems. You're not going to do a lot of damage to the Rock Golems. That's the problem. So, you're going to have to shoot the Manticore as well with the shotgun. So, keep that in mind. I would say... Probably, if you are going to do it like that, it's going to be hard, man. But 33,000 HP and probably 700 plus melee damage, I would say. But honestly, I wouldn't take Rexus into the Manticore fight. The, the rock golems make it really difficult. <laughs> oh, thanks, Venus. I appreciate that, man. But, uh, yeah, you're part of this team now, man. Like I said to Aim Goat, remember, if we're playing here, it's everybody is playing here. We share almost everything. You don't have to do stuff on your own. If you need help, Venice, just say, we can come and help you, man. You want to do something, ask for wingman or anything. Hey boys, this is Venice's house. It's looking pretty cool actually, Venice. Did you take a skin, Venice? Okay, you need to take one of these skins. Uh, and then, just do this. So it fits the rest of the town you can take one skin and do the entire house 
like that you need to do the western skin all right i'm gonna take this one and i'm gonna put it in here for you you can have that one then just do the the rest of your house for that skin but it looks pretty cool man very funky i like the pillars that's actually pretty cool that's something different. Do you mind if I look inside? I hope you don't mind. I just want to see what you got going here. Nice little step going here. And then this goes out to the back. And then you've got this going up. Oh, this is pretty cool. And then you've got your dinos on top. Very cool, man. Very, very cool. Just need a door here. Okay, there's no door. Let me close this door that's the only reason i was looking at the door is i wanted to close it this is looking pretty sweet very cool but it's built out of wood why <laughs> you gonna survive i hope you survive man adobe is better did you get it zemo nice see I knew I just had to show you once and you'll be able to do it. I had faith. I had faith. I just believed. I just believed. I like these cake bones. They are so cool. Look at that. <laughs> this little baby. Little baby cheeky. Cheeky briggy. Think Widow will be fine if you die, you die. Two point six percent, yes. We are gonna raise this baby for a while. She's gonna be raising for a while. In fact, I should actually check what else I got in my little baby cryo storage freezer thingy here. Let's see what else we got, guys. Babies, we've got a little giga baby. We got a mantis. I need to raise this baby that is that's the lightning damage baby this one has got lots of damage for a lightning wave and i mean lots 30 no 43 points in damage why you do that why you do that I'm little baby. What times would I use for the Manticore? What have you done, Colby? What have you done? Have you done the dragon yet? Have you done any of the other boss fights? The reason I'm asking is... Do you have a tech rifle or any tech rifle stuff yet? Let me put it that way. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna space the babies out a little bit. Eat the baby. <laughs> no Java. Uh uh. Bad Java. Bad Java. By the way, guys, it's Saturday, so tonight, everybody, we're gonna do the monkey boss and the dragon on the island. Remember that. I'm gonna actually bring them in onto the island. We're not fighting them in the arena. We're gonna fight them in a very funky, cool way. We're fighting them in the Colosseum, and we're gonna do it with swords. <laughs> and it does work. It does work. And you're gonna want to do that, because you guys are gonna need the transmitter at some point. So keep in mind, a little bit later, we're doing two bosses on the island for everybody.
Okay, so you've did all the bosses. That's good. Then... You can do Rexes then. But have maybe two Deodons. Have two Deodons and one UT. And the guys on the Deodons need to each take in two sets of tech rifles because the tech rifle with some element will kill the golem like this a tech rifle can kill a golem really fast really really fast eat baby <laughs> no we know eat baby we feed baby you guys are bad parents this thing has got a lot of damage. Ew, this baby has got loads of damage. That is a lot of damage for baby Waven. That's not even been imprinted. This baby's gonna be good. It's gonna be huge. 18 food. 19. Might have to go get some milk from them. <coughs> So Colby, that's what I'm saying. Two Deodons, you can shoot off a Deodon. Let me show you. I've got a Deodon here somewhere. Or is it in the tribe community? I need to actually put that back. Damn it, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> or go for... Uh, where's the Deodon? You haul. Right, so... Okay, see. You can shoot off a Deodon. And still kind of manage it and walk around with it and all kinds of stuff. Okay. So the guys who are going to be on the Deodons, two of them with tech rifles, that should be enough to just get rid of most of the golems. Or at least kill some of the golems. That's what I would suggest. Then the Rexes can eat... The Wavens, uh, the Death Worms, the Rexes can eat the Death Worms. And you guys can just climb off your Rex. Just let go and shoot at the Manticore with the shotgun. That'll work. That'll work. Get in my belly. <laughs> but doesn't this baby look like it's something you would say? Get in my belly. It's a vicious cycle. I eat when I'm sad. I'm sad when I eat. I love that. It's pretty fun. Hey. Let me put my sign back. You guys are so horrifically torched. Here we go. Uh, Marshall. That's it. My sign is back. Now we need to just put this back and fix everything else that's kind of got damage. Like this one. Just gotta sing the sandwich song. What is the sandwich song, Java? What is that? I don't know what's the sandwich song. Got some adobe that I put down here. Ah, oh, some clay. Hey, here we go. I have a wooden thatch. Okay. Quickly go get that.
They should make it like you can throw an axe. Like if you would hold in right click like this. Like you can throw your axe. That would be so realistic and cool at the same time. You know how many people would lose tools? Now I have to check everything to make sure that it's not been damaged. Even my door's been damaged. You guys, why? Why? Close the door. Let's see. Door's fine. How about the door frame? Door frame, okay. And these pillars, yeah, even the pillars damaged. The skin is even off this one. <laughs> oh wait, no, 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 no. We're even missing an entire pillar here. Yeah, this pillar's missing. Yeah, there's an entire pillar missing on this side. There we go. All right, sweet. Now I just need actually one more. Okay, and then we put the skin on it. Okay, cool. What is this then? A wooden pillar. Why is there a wooden pillar? Go fo, go fo, go fo. That's it. And the marshal's house has been restored. Wait, we need to repair this as well. The bell? Bell's fine. I'm probably gonna have to check my roof. I'm probably gonna have to check the roof. Yeah, even the roof needs to be fixed. So what happened is someone threw an oil jar on my house. Not just one, a few. I had like five oil jars burning on my house for some reason. Great song, Fred. <laughs> Hey, 
big brain? <laughs> bandits. It was bandits? Uh, is it because they knew I was the sheriff? Is that why I have to find these bandits and just bring them to justice? Justice. Because I'm bad. I mean, the mortal. You looked all over for them, you couldn't find them, not even a trace. That sucks. We'll get them next time, Ben. We'll get them next time. We'll wait for them to ride into town and then we'll get them. We'll get them. I think I fixed my house now. Sneaky trollops. <laughs> yeah, these bandits, damn it. Setting my house on fire. I saw that message or the picture in in Discord and I just went My house is on fire. What can I say? It's because I'm the sheriff, you know? Bandits will be bandits. In fact, I know exactly how to take care of these bandits. Builds a bank needs to watch it like a hawk. I agree. I totally agree. That didn't work. Hold on. That didn't work. We need to redo these two. Just okay. there. Why is it not... It's not giving me the wire. Why is it not actually... Giving the wire. That's it. These bandits will be taught a lesson. What I should do, actually, what I should do is, um, actually, what I should do ah, oh, crap, I ran over it. Okay, we'll just put that one back. Uh, I should actually, while he's stuck here. <laughs> That's perfect. That's the way you do it, boys. That's the way you do it. We'll just put that one there. 
That's it. <laughs> I hope Gopo is not watching the stream. Gopo! <laughs> Are you there, Gopo? Don't be. Booby traps? Yeah. Okay, we need to go get some food and put it in the griller. Let's take one of these bad boys and go eat some stuff. Let's go see what's happening around the corner here at our local Dodie meeting. No meeting? Oh, what? They fixed it. Over here, it's normally like a Dodicarus meeting. Wrong button. Oh, where is this thing running to now? Come here, Morella Tops. some meat a little bit we need a little bit more actually what's going on here who died okay okay i'll leave you i'll leave you i'll leave you i shall leave with you and then we shall uh, go put it in the cooker we shall be cooking the meat eat the babies i will come put your house on fire java Your, your house is now skinned and up to the building code. All right, sweet. I will come and investigate in a few seconds. Let's just get some stamina. Stamina, eh, eh. Stamina, stamina. Stamina, stamina, stamina. Is that a micro raptor? No, it's an archaeocoptrix. Man. It was like, jeez. What are the odds? Run straight into. Let me just go put Java's house on fire. Hold on. Stamina, stamina, stamina! Ah, oh, look at that. That looks pretty cool. That looks so freaking cool, man. Ah, doesn't that look good? That actually looks really nice. I love this wooden skin. They should actually bring out more stuff like that. But in not only like Western style, like other types of styles and stuff as well. I like it. It looks really cool. Oh, we need to see what how food how much food does this thing have? Am I stuck on it? Yeah, what sauce? Whoa! Okay, <laughs> yeah, that was a perfect glitch and off. Food, but this food's right here. Why are you not eating this? Let's 
sauce, what's going on? You're not eating your pots? Then I'll have to report them. Jobba! Hello! Is Jobba here? <laughs> Wait, I can see you there. Miss Bojangles. Okay. That could be cool, Lee. Yeah, that could actually be cool. Yeah, so now they've got the Western style with the Cowboys. I don't know if they will, though, but that could be cool. The roly poly. Stamina, 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 stamina. It's time for more stamina. Summit, you! My guy, are you still alive? <laughs> yes, he's Summit. It's been a while. How are you doing? I haven't seen you since what? Last year? Yeah, I think it was last year. Good to see you again, man. Let me jump into the madhouse here, guys. Oh. Well, I suppose I don't have to stand around and wait for it to cook. Happy Friday, Ben. Ben just said in-game. Happy Friday, guys. Time off the weekend. Time for some beers. We should all go to... to uh, Pickles Bar and go have a beer. Why don't I stream like the previous schedule, like in the day as well? Uh, things changed a little bit, Summit. Things changed a little bit, man. So, we've been having some electricity problems. And also, I'm trying to get videos out as well, not just streaming. So, I do about, I do a video or two, or I try to do at least one video every second or third day and then uh, I do stream once every single day uh, the previous schedule was kind of a bit rough and it's also just streaming then I didn't make any videos and things or I struggled to get to it so I changed it slightly 4.6 this is not a fast growing up baby. By no means. By no means. Ben, let's go have a beer. Where's Ben? Yo, slow down, buddy. <laughs> You're drinking all the beer? Let's have a beer. I'm gonna sit here with you, Ben. Hold on.
No. Why did they change? Oh no, what happened? Did I now break the swivel chair? Why it change? Well, okay, let's have some beer. <laughs> That's it, Ben. Yeah, mm, I'm better. I'm been having a good Friday, man. How you doing? Mm. Been having a good day. How how's your day been, score Ben? Mine's been good, man. How you doing, son? <laughs> it's hard to be Marshall down here in these parts. Mexican thug villages. Summit, I'm the Marshall. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good, thanks. Yeah, well, uh, let's eat something here as well. Mm, yeah, How, how's your day been, Bane? You kind of look like. Anyway, uh, anyway, Bane, I'm gonna. Let me just go home a little bit here. I'm just gonna go home. Let me go home, guys. I think the marshal's office is that way. And then the beer energy kicks in and we sprint off into the desert, never to be found again. I mean, I'm just joking, I'm Marshall, I have to be here. I need some whiskey? Oh, that would be nice. Whiskey would actually be nice. Unfortunately, the saloon we have only makes beer. But whiskey would be cool. But you know, guys, every now and then, sometimes, we got to go take a swim, you know? Take a bath. We had some beer, so let's go take a swim. Uh, I've got no stamina. I might actually die when I do this. But what the hell? Let's just call it beer courage. There must be some deeper parts in this lake. <laughs> I'm gonna run in here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Okay. La, 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 la. Taking a swim, washing myself. That's it. We are now clean. Well, it's not entirely the square. <laughs> okay, let me just put my clothes on before anybody sees me. All right, boys, the marshal's back. That was fun, Ben. We should do that next Friday again. I'm sorry, buddy. You're way too pink. You're violating our code of conduct. Now, now I gotta take you to prison. I mean, that sucks. <laughs> you, you, you don't fit. I, I... Why is Tony in prison? Why is Tony in prison? Who put Tony here? <laughs> Who sentenced Tony to prison? Oh my gosh. Tony is going to think that was me. He's going to think it was me. This is Gopo's work. I'm pretty sure of it.
No, his house is here. This is his house. He even has the Alpha Manticore up there. Look at that. Holy crap. That looks kind of weird. I, I spotted a villain. I see a villain, boys. I see a villain. Okay. Threat's been taken care of. Can a Waven pick dinos up? Yes, Venice, they can. Wavens can actually pick up some dinos that orgies cannot. So we've been using the wavens to actually trap some of the stuff in the traps we have. Definitely. Most definitely. Five point one percent. That's insane. Okay guys, if you have beards, please return your glasses <laughs> to the saloon. Uh, I just thought about that. We need to just take our glasses back. I'm gonna go put my glass back now. Poor Pickle, our saloon manager. That's how people treat unwavering guests, be bowlers them, when they get out of hand a little bit. Let's put this back in. Alright, well that's a lot of food for a baby, so I'm gonna put this in here. Cheeky baby. <laughs> they still look so pretty. It's like a little golden color in him, actually. Or in her. And I want to see what she's going to look like when she grows up. Very cool. Yo, look at this thing's eyes, like all shiny. Hey, Golem. Yo, Rob Golem. Golem. Wait, are we hitting the last artifact cave? Are we gonna hit the last artifact cave? Because we have. I've got destroyer and I've got gatekeeper. So we just need one more and then we'll have to collect some talents and stuff. I think the baby will grow up with that food. I mean, he's on. He's over 5%. That should be okay. Five point three with all of this, yeah. In fifteen minutes, all right, cool, no problem. No problems. No problems. Go and tame another one of these actually. Maybe we should do that. 
quickly go look for another vulture. Ah, wait. We need organic polymer. I want to fix my ghillie. That's what I wanted to do. Alright, let's take the waven. see what you're doing there <laughs> all right let's go uh we're actually kind of in the middle here so the closest to us let me someone grab the red drops let's go get the red drops and eat some some uh, some uh, some mantis M -m 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 mantis well it's a mantis get some organic polymer come back fix my ghillie and then we'll go tame a vulture What is this? What is this? Blue Vixens get away bad. If the storm hits, okay, that's kind of pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> Looks kind of nice, and I mean, that's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. Is that for when her boyfriend comes to town? <laughs> Ah, I see, I see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there was a really good looking Tapayara flying around here. I was thinking of taming it. But I might need some assistance. I wonder if we can bowl it and put a tent over it. That would probably be the easiest. Bowl it and put a tent over it. I'm actually gonna try that. I'm gonna I'm gonna get my organic polymer, get this drop, the other drop, and then go back, grab my tent, fix my ghillie. And then we'll come find the toppy. You got two of them? Oh, nice, Marcia. I saw this very good looking one. I'm, it's just gonna be for the color. That's the only reason I would even do it. Oh, nice. Got ourselves some tools. A tool blueprint. 215. That is pretty nice. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. I'm actually very impressed with Zema that she came and she got her milk on her own. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. I should actually fly back and see if it respawned. It might have. Uh, I didn't even check. It might actually have respawned. The minute you fly out to render, it respawns. Then you can go and grab the other one and you have to wait an hour. Let's go back. It probably respawned. Let's see if it did. Didn't even check that. Did it? 
Nope. Ah, I did. Yeah, I did. It did. It did. And there's a mantis. And there's a scorpion. Yeehaw! Now we can go back to the other one. <laughs> Would you guys be the guys that are playing on the server? Would you guys be interested in trying something similar like the guys from Monarchy did, where only certain people can tame certain things and use certain things which will enable everybody to trade with each other do you guys be interested in doing something like that i actually thought that was a pretty cool concept that you guys have to actually then trade with each other that's a pretty cool thing to do i think this is a purple mantis Oh, and it was 125. That was a pretty cool concept. I think I've got enough poly now. Let's grab this drop and then uh, bam, soon. Some of these snakes have got the coolest colors as well. I mean, I'm not sure about the pink ones, but some of them look pretty nice. Had to know, boss. Wow. <laughs> That's terrible. That is such a bad drop. That is a bad drop. I don't think this one's gonna respawn now. I don't think so. Let's fly out of render and come back and see. Mm, I think now we have to fly to the next one. Probably. Yeah, I don't think this one's gonna do that. Next one be down there. Okay, let's go grab it. Seeing more mantis is a good sign. Who was talking to you about some station and you told him to talk to me? No one, Orson. No one said anything to me about the station. I said that you suggested we come look at the station at night so we can see what the lights and the stuff look like. Don't think anyone said anything about the station. Flying through the desert. Another fast. 
by him through the desert. Okay, we got two more little squares on the map to go and then we'll be there. I wonder if I should probably make it there with the stamina that I have. Fly hand through the desert. I'm not seeing any cool looking vultures actually. I mean that one looks kind of cool. With the yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Wee. I should actually not do this. Push my wave in until he stamps completely out. Because watch me land and then a dead worm jumps out and I've got no stamp. <laughs> no stamp to kill it. That would be kind of funny actually. Let's not let's not do that. Alright, nice. Here's the next drop. We actually have some mantis here as well. Whee! Auto Prulish Shadow. I don't think that thing is any use in PvE. I don't think it's got any use. What you gonna do with an all throw in PvE? It's got like a green little head on him. Alright, guys, what you what would you do with an Arthur Plura on PvE? For PvP, it's obviously to destroy the metal bases and the stuff, but on PvE, I don't know if that's got any use. I don't think so. Some of these ruins are actually done really nicely. Let's go check what's happening in this one quickly. Oh, there's a artifact on top there. Yeah. Explorer note. Hey! After I stopped the bugs from ransacking that whistle stop, I guess I thought maybe I'd found a place worth building up into something. That's when the witch piped up to tell us why it wasn't worth getting attached to no place there. Oh no, why? Said she and her friends had a regular boom town going across the desert that got blown to heck by something in the sky. She offered to fly us to see the ruins for ourselves. Not sure why I let the professor and the doc talk me into that. Hi uh, guys, does that guy not sound like Tony? <laughs> <laughs> Tony's famous. Okay, boys. Explorer note, Bob's Tales. Boom, right here at... 76, 78, 76, 78. You'll probably go get all of them at some point. They give you an extra couple of levels. At first, I wasn't so wow about the Bob's Tales, but... Bob's Tales be Bob's Tales. What is that? Is that an AK-47? What is she holding in her hand? It's like some kind of gun. That's a magazine. That's also a gun. What the shit is this? Look, there's a scope. There's the barrel. There's the magazine. Crazy Egyptian people here. I might have skins from that. Let's see. Nope. Don't see any. I 
I can guarantee you, I think I know where the next one's going to be. There's this big ruin. Where's the red obi? Let's go to the red obi. There's this big ruin into the cliff side. Uh, I've been wanting to check it out actually for some time. Let's go grab some grappling hooks and stuff. And then we can go and explore that ruin a little bit. There's probably going to be a bobtail there as well. You get skins from getting the bobtail uh, notes. What kind of skins? Shouldn't you actually add the mod? Because I saw they were advertising a mod the other day that you get all these kind of cartoony skins, but I don't like the cartoony stuff so much. I mean, this game looks fantastic. It looks really good. Putting something cartoony in a realistic game would kind of break it. Me, personally. Quickly just make a little few more. I think I do have some, but we'll just make it. Oh, wait, I forgot the poly in the Waven. Put the poly in the Waven, actually. Fix my Geely. There we go. There we go. Gilly fixed. Let's put this in here. Fantastic. If we can quickly make one of these, that's a pretty cool blueprint. Craft one, if we can. All right, then we can take this to the town, to the store. We'll put it in here. Armor. It will probably be weapons. You buy weapons. Armor fur. Got some fur, yeah. And then saddles. It needs to go. Why is this not? Master Croft. Cool. I don't think we'll ever use this one, so I'm gonna just dump that and that. And then we can put the ghillie back. Quickly have a look at my little baby faso that's growing. Grab my spear. Like that. Put this in here. We are ready to rumble, boys. Wait, 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 wait. I need to put my gilly back. 
Choo. Method, how you doing? How do you kill fire alpha waven without burning to death? You build a trap. You catch it in a trap. And you can just shoot it or have a thyla or something eat it. But best way to kill it is to put it in a trap. You can even put a ballista somewhere down and then kill it like that. But why you want to kill the alpha? It's easier to actually take some of the other wavens and just knock them out with darts and stuff. Way easier. There's a video on my channel that shows you how to build a waven trap if you need one. You can be one person to operate it actually. Just fly over it or change the bottom a little bit and you will catch the waven in it. The waven will not be able to get out. And then you can knock it out with a crossbow, trank arrows, or whichever way you want to do it. Uh, yeah, let's quickly go check out that. Are oh, you welcome, man. Where are you from? Method, where are you from? I can quickly go show you what the trap looks like. Just go to my channel, scroll through it. I think it's like the fourth latest video. I'm on my way to the red obelisk anyway, so I can quickly show you. We'll aggro a wave and quickly get it into the trap. And then once it's in, you can just they'll be out. A female, any female wave and gives you five milk. And that's a lot. Five milk is a lot. You see it? Sweet, man. Alright, in that case, I guess I can head towards the ruins. And then the alpha will give you lots, but... I mean, five milk is more than enough to raise a couple of babies. And once you've got some wavens grown up, stealing more eggs and stuff is a breeze. It is really so easy. Wait. Ah, uh, that's not a good looking top bar. Xbox PS5 finally getting premium. Oh, that is good news. Yo, Lee, that is such good news. That is really good news. I like this color though. What is the level of this one? 60. Mm. I don't know, 60 is a bit low, but I like the color. The green and the yellow is pretty nice. That is pretty good news, man. That's pretty good news. So you guys can finally do, like, survive the night and stuff. But you can't kill a fire without killing yourself. But you don't have to kill it. You knock it. Okay, hold on. Let me show you. Let me show you. I'll show you. Let me go get my, my taming stuff. You don't have to kill it. You just need to knock it out. You can. I'm saying you don't even need to get the alpha. Don't go for the alpha. Why are you going for the alpha? How many babies are you raising? How many fire or how many waven babies do you have that need smoke? Let's grab some stamina. I'm going to show you how quickly. I actually need milk for my two babies, so I might as well quickly do this. Let's do this. Go back to town, grab my trank stuff, and then we'll quickly trank a waven. Oh, you want the trophy? Ah! <laughs> okay, I see. Yeah, trap it. Build a ballista and put some spear bolts. The fire waven has got range and if you're out of range he can't he can't fire breath you but you can still shoot him oh, we got a sandstorm coming that sucks 
Yeah, you can do a ballista. You can just shoot it with a. Oh, excuse me, guys. Shoot it with a gun. You can. There's actually lots of ways you can kill it once it's in a trap. Yeah, you can use a thyla, run with a thyla, and then bite it. The bleeding damage that the thyla gives will kill it. Should kill it. Kinda happy I came back. These guys need imprinting. What you want? A walk? What you want? Wave and milk. Oh. Well. I guess we're getting wave and milk. <laughs> I guess we're getting wave and milk. Let's get this baby back on here. Fantastic. Let me get into my house, my house, my house. Damn it, tumbleweed, what you doing in the house? Uh, where's my yellow crossbow? I think it's up there. Is it in here? Yeah, there we go. My track arrows be down here. I did not put beds down there, so we might need to just make a sleeping bag. The trap I actually want to use. Okay. And there we go. Tree! <laughs> oh, is the sandstorm still going? Why? I love the sky when it clears up. Look at that. Oh, it is so beautiful. When the sandstorms and the stuff actually clear up, it looks so beautiful and then just pff, it goes away. It's like magic. Never happened. All right, let's go to the Waven Trench. We'll quickly go trap a Waven. Look for a female tranker. Get her milk. Feed my babies, and we'll be ready, ready to rumble. You need Waven Claw trophies for the man. No, 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 no. Method, no. You don't need the alpha. Uh uh. You need normal ones. That means any Waven. You're gonna need poison, lightning, and fire. Twenty of each. And it's not the alpha. It's normal ones. That you need for for the boss fight let me show you i'm gonna land here by uh, the red orbi quickly not the uh, the alpha trophy no it's normal weapons can't wait to upgrade my pc to enjoy graphics <laughs> thanks Venus. But the fire and the alpha burn. Ah, okay, so it's personal. So because they burned you, you want to go kill him? All right. Actually, they shouldn't aggro on you at all, to be honest. The alpha doesn't aggro that quickly as the other ones. 
But we are here. Let's land. Grab some stamp. And then we'll carry on. Carry on my way, world song. It is my trap. So when I built this trap, I thought it would be a good idea to come through the trench like this, turn around and go like this. But <laughs> I should actually turn it around and take it a little bit down. I should actually do that. Uh, let's see. What is this? Bald female. Okay. Hello, lady. Did I aggro you? I did not. I did now. Now, that is a poison waven. <laughs> so, that thing's reach is even more than the other ones. Put my sleeping bag down. I'm gonna stand here and I'm gonna trank it from here. And if it shoots me, I'm going to hide behind this rock. Let me grab some milk. It doesn't seem to like want to shoot me here. Oh, don't look at me like that. <laughs> Please don't shoot me. Because that poison ball has got range. Yo, that thing's got range. I'm risking it for a biscuit. Okay, she's out. Perfect. Oh, well, that's brilliant. Wait, 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 we can fix this, we can fix this. Whee! And we land. I'll take her milk. Milk! Thank you so much, lady. Ah, uh, Marson? <laughs> Marson. You finally became a member. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Much love, Marson. Much love. Thanks, man. Every little bit help, guys. Every little bit help. Okay. And there we go. And she's be dead. She'd be dragged out. We believe in. Let's go feed the milk to the babies. Thanks, Barsa.
the green name crew yeah yes you guys there's so many people that's green it's incredible you guys are just the best helping a lot with the server and me and everything it's incredible i made that look super easy <laughs> Venus. <laughs> so yesterday, Blue, uh, Vixen, and Marson and Squirrel went taming rock golems, and they watched my video on how to get rock golems. And Vixen also said, "She said, get damn solo. You make it look so easy." <laughs> ah, Marson, thank you so much, man. Ah, uh, thanks, Is. How are you doing, Is? How's things going? He was watching that. <laughs> hey, there's a red drop. Let's take the red drop. Okay. Maybe we get some good stuff in here. Some good stuff. These orbital drops are actually not bad. Hey, a shorty. Yes, some. Um, that would be such a great beginner um, drop. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Okay, now we can put the milk in this one and he can eat. We'll go grab the other one and quickly give him his milk. What's the baby? This one? I'm not sure if it was this one. I think it was this one. Hey! It sucks that you can't cryo the babies anymore and throw them out and then they ask for something different. That really sucks. They should bring that back. That was actually pretty cool. We. No, no, wait. <laughs> you didn't make wait. That's why. Why? Two thousand seven hundred. This one probably eight as well. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Your food. You're at nineteen point five. How come your food so low? Why is this one's food so low? There we go. That's better. And then I have one spear. One spear. Okay. don't need this all right guys i'm gonna go back to that ruins i want to have a hook and watch around the ruins and see what they look like babies have been given milk there is peace in the red rock <laughs> hey there's a hello red rock Ooh, that's nasty. Being eaten by Perlovia. Oh, okay. Someone's already here. Cool, cool, cool. Let's fly to these ruins. I've been wanting to come and check this out a little bit. I don't know if I need a dino. I don't think I need one. I mean, we can just quickly have a look on foot and see what that looks like. I don't know what to expect or what we'll find there or if there's going to be like massive danger or not. But let's see. One way to find out is to do it. Can't ride the bus. You don't have a ticket.
So these are the ruins. I just want to come and explore. Nothing here. You and Blue was here. Okay, but let me see. Let's see. What's... Oh shit. I didn't even see that one. I didn't even see that one. I should have cooked this. I should have cooked it. Okay, when you're ready or done with that, we'll come and check that out. So what's what's all Woo. Holy snap, it's close. <laughs> what level is it? 45. It's little, it's little one. Listen, RG, are you done with this now? We've got a very upset golem chasing me. Okay. So, yes, what I want to do. So it's just like a little upstairs, little runway here. Uh, nothing going on really over there. Very cool. Very cool, very cool. I just need something to eat. Red versus red. I kind of like it though. I like these ruins and the stuff. They are so interesting for me. You never know what you're going to find in here. I really enjoy exploring some of them. Ah, Marson, I still need to first tame myself a rock golem, man. Once I get one, we can do boxing. This would be a nice base location for someone. So easy to lock off. I wonder if you'll get the heat stroke and the stuff inside here. Super heat. Maybe not. Okay, so this is kind of it. Looking actually pretty cool inside here. I love it. Oh crap. I might have to go back. My... Passo might want imprinting. <laughs> what you gonna do, Martin? Yeah, I'm leaving, man. I think my Passo baby needs imprinting. I kind of forgot about that. But I'm gonna come and check this out. Hey, he's gonna box. All right, I want to see this. Oh no, we got a storm. Oh, that sucks. I think, let's see, I think it's that one. It's 
start that one? Or not? Am I shooting my own Waven? I'm not sure which one it is. I don't know. You'll find him, he's here somewhere. <laughs> Boom. Orgy dead. Yeah, look at that. 14 damage. It's incredible, man. These things take so little damage. A bit rough though. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I think I am. Slightly off this way. I untrack those guys. And then they pop up again. It's so irritating. slightly and it's cleared let's get to town i completely forgot about the faso baby and i do not want to miss that baby's imprint i think we need to just go and get that get that sorted quickly before i explore and check out more places So baby. Yo cheeky. Yeah, she's asking for it. I knew it. What you want? What you want? Cuddles. Oh. Is that it? Just he does like this and that's it? That's a bit boring. <laughs> I mean, spit some acid or do a backflip or something, that would have been cool. I wonder whose melee damage we got. And also her skin is actually now toning a little bit better. Now that she's slightly growing up. Hey Jiggy. Web defeat in twos. Looking very cool. Looking very, very cool. How long do we have now? Two hours before the next imprint. Alright. Two hours. Or actually all of them. That would mean... Okay. Alright. Five o'clock my time. I'm gonna leave these babies out a little bit. I don't think the food went down that much. Let me see. Three thousand looking good 3000 yeah 
looking pretty good. Might have to go get milk a little bit later if one of them asks for milk again, but that should not be a problem. Ooh, that's kind of nice. Oh, that is nice. Yo, look at this green. Hold on. Oh, that is looking so nice. Who's, who's waving is this? It's Zemas. Zemo, you've got, I love this green color on your wings. That's pretty cool. Looking good, looking good. Martian said the other train station's done. Let's go check it out. That's also pretty nice, that color with the wings. The darker green. Okay. Where's the other station, Martian? You said the other train station is also kind of done, right? So let's follow the railroad, boys. Let's follow the railroad. So this is the first station. Or did you mean this one is done? I think that's probably what you meant. You meant that one is done. Yeah. I think that's what you meant. That train station is done. Ah, okay, the first one, that one. Okay, cool. She just needs to come and add the detail. Sweet, man. Are you guys going to make every train station look the same? Or uh, is it going to look a little bit different? Probably a little bit different. That would be nice. If each station its own kind of personality. And then when Ben comes, we've got one more cave to do. The artifact cave. The last one. This is the normal one. That's just a normal explorer note. Keep that one for a little bit later. Does this go anywhere? Now it's a hole. Reaper! A coolest Reaper. Hello, where are you from? Welcome to the stream. What level is the rich? Cannot see. <laughs> Let's put that on. That'll help. Ah, oh, it's a 40. Okay, it's not that good. It's not that good. The eastern side of America, is that like... I'm not from America, so... Is that like... Florida, Georgia type of side? Going on a wild guess here. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, look at that. Yes, it's beautiful. Ah, vicious. The minute I said Florida, you popped in. Oh, Virginia. Okay, cool. Welcome, man. What's up, V? How you doing? How's your day going, buddy? Happy Friday, boys! Oh, JP! Ah, oh, much love, much love. I am so glad I helped you guys out. Look, that Phoenix trap was colossal, but only because it was at a really crappy place. That angle made it a little bit difficult. You can actually just build two foundations by two foundations two stories high and it'll be more than enough to catch a phoenix
New York, Florida, Maine, East Coast. Florida is the best. Anywhere else is lesser. <laughs> yeah, okay, guys. So just ignore wishes. Sometimes he just... Uh, next he'll probably threaten someone by punching them. That's how he is. <laughs> What's your plans for the weekend, V? Ooh, look at this thing. Holy crap. Pink with is it cyan feet? Look at that thing. It is cyan feet. Oh. Nope. Don't give me the words I spew will be the most important things you will hear. Ah. Oh. We are so blessed to be in your presence. We Okay now, but seriously, what you doing the weekend? Vicious fist fight crocs for fun. <laughs> yeah, he kind of does. He loves, he kind of likes uh, fist fights and stuff. That is the best looking. No way. Look at this. I've never seen this before. What? Why are we being attacked? What? What's going on here? Look at that. That is, that is so cool. The iguana dawn. That color is so cool, actually. I like it. What level are you? What level are you? 85. Not doing much the weekend. Taking it slow. Slow mo. Anybody else? What you guys doing the weekend? You guys doing something cool, interesting? I mean, obviously, the most important is to come to the stream and play ARK and stuff. We all know that. But uh, anything else you guys might be doing in real life that's pretty cool. Sometimes when I ask people that, they come up with, like, not come up. They actually do, like, in real life, do some really cool stuff. And then I think, man, that is so freaking cool. Spring cleaning. Ben, when are you going fishing again? That fishing pictures you sent us the last time, that was pretty impressive, man. That was quite nice. That's what I wanted to do. I was looking for a tapa, a nice color tapa. That's it. That's it. That's the one. I was flying around here going, I wanted to do something, but I couldn't remember what it was. Real life, having a chill weekend in game, breeding weapons. JB. That's the best, man. That's the best. Which weapons? What are you going for? You doing fire, lightning, or poison poison? Which ones are you going for? Maybe go a bit higher, see if we can get some tapas up here. Gonna get you've got a boat? What boat do you have? Is it like a little dinghy or what type of boat do you have? Ben? Send us a picture there in Discord, man. Oh guys, by the way, we've got Discord. There's a description in the link. Ah, oh, there's a link. Let me just get my words right. <laughs> in the description there is a link to Discord. <laughs> You guys can join us in Discord. Be nice to have you, boys. I kind of like it. It's a pity it's such a low level, though. The green is absolutely beautiful. Ah, oh, the... Thanks, man. Oh, you've got a pretty decent 1975. Sounds like that's a pretty decent big motorboat. 80? Or should we do an 80? I don't know. I don't know about this. I mean, I kind of like the color, but... Mm. Morrison, what colors did you get? On the two tapas that you tamed? 
painting your house the weekend. Is there like a, a reason why everybody is kind of renovating their houses? Is this like the season or something? Because Zema painted her house the other day. Venice is doing it. Is it like something you guys do in the USA? Like this is now the, the good time to do that or how does that work? Winter is over, it's springtime now. What I can see. What are the odds that we're gonna run into a phoenix? I wonder where Vixen saw that blue one. That would be nice to see. Yo, that's a pink paraser. <laughs> that is a pretty pink paraser. Bandits? Yo, Java, you are far behind on the stream, my friend. I believe, yeah, a blue phoenix. Yeah, so I tamed the pink one. It's the event colors. So the Phoenix actually take colors from the event as well. And Vixen saw a blue one around here somewhere. I'm not sure 100% where she saw it, but I'm gonna guess it's around here. Not entirely too sure. Maybe it is, maybe it's not. Oh, I already tamed one, Ace. <laughs> I already got one. I'll show you guys now. Got a pink one. Let's fly around, see if we can see it. It should be... You saw the pink one? Yeah, it was the pink one. It's the pink one that I tamed. She's, she's got a, a blue one that she saw here somewhere. It's a pity she's not online now. Maybe just give me some direction to where. I'd love to see it. If I could. Let's see. Where's the town? Town is over there. It could be here somewhere. We might fly into it. Let's see. Yeah, it's got like a really nice... I've seen one before, I just, just saw it and then I lost track of it. Then we did a, a wild dino wipe and then the pink one came. And then I ended up taming the pink one. And she kind of wants to try and tame... Oh, snap. Well, I mean... We're going down, son. <laughs> we are going down. I didn't check my stamina. Man, I hate these ants. Like something crazy. Mayday, 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 we're going down. The sheriff's in trouble. Marshall. The marshal's in trouble. Okay. So we've seen the normal red one, I've seen the pink one, and I saw the blue one. I might actually help her tomorrow to tame that blue one, it looks pretty nice, like it looked really amazing. Even more so than the pink one. I don't know if we'll be here, it'll probably be towards the red obby. Let's go check the red obby again. Is 
it's difficult to find them that's a probably the worst part is finding them taming is really not that difficult there's so many ways you can do it you can use a fire weapon you can use fire arrows you can use oil jars you can use a flamethrower it's it basically just has to be a type of fire that you do to it and on ase the super heat waves didn't last that long but over here on ASA, they last actually pretty long. This, you don't even have to be worried about running out of time. So once you you found it and you trapped it, taming it is really easy. It's the finding part that's really hard. Getting it is super hard, actually. I mean, look at this. The the heat wave is still going. It's incredible how long the super heat wave lasts. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Goblin. Go for this joint. Yeah, go for this joint. Let's go check that out. <laughs> I got something special cooking. Fire weapon, yeah? You can use a fire weapon. You basically have to set the phoenix on fire. That's all you have to do. And it'll tame. You have to do it a few times. Someone's little house. I hope I make it to town quickly. We should. You guys are gonna want to see this. <laughs> you guys are gonna want to see this. This is gonna be cool. Let's make it to town. I'm almost out of stam again. But you gotta do this. Floor it! I'm going, Lee! I'm going! <laughs> I'm going! I'm going! As fast as I can! Oh, just land! Fire wave, just land! Okay. I think he escaped my trap. I actually booby trapped his house. <laughs> I booby trapped Gopo's house. I think he escaped. Or he must have seen it. I don't know. Maybe he knew. Maybe he watched the stream. Who knows? Let me show you guys the Phoenix that I have. Uh, my Phoenix is not the fridge, this one. <laughs> that is the pink phoenix Let's cut some points. Let's put some points into Stam. Put some into HP. We'll up the melee damage a little bit. I don't know if I need weight, but let's add some. Will I be able to hit 300 melee damage? 300 melee damage. Boom. Let's give it 5,000 and then some stamina. That's it. Right, let's go burn something, boys. Let's go set something on fire. What statistic of jail is full or empty? Well, we got someone in jail. Right, let's go set something on fire here. 
Let's find something to burn. This thing is crazy, boys. Look at that. And I can go through there. It does nothing to me. And if I bite it, let's go bite the Pariser. I'm gonna go attack the Pariser quickly. Normal bite. <laughs> yes! <laughs> it's just fire! What do you mean zero damage? It does a lot of damage, man. Ah, oh, okay, but I mean, this wasn't a level 150 Phoenix. Let's go to town. Let's go to town. Go stand in town. Let me shoot you with a ball of fire and see how much damage you take, man. For science. <laughs> Let's do it for science. I think this thing is freaking beautiful, man. And it's got decent range on it. Yeah, for science. Just take your armor off. Let me not mess your armor up. Imagine the luck of finding a 150 Phoenix. That would be insane. I don't even know what the level of the blue one is. Ah, uh, 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 don't shoot the Phoenix. I will shoot you with my gun. <laughs> do that again? Wait, do that again? Shoot me with a fire arrow again, Ben. Does absolutely nothing. Well done, Bane. Well done. Yeah, so that's a pink one. And we still have the heat wave. No idea what the level on the blue one even is. And I don't know what it is. I'll ask, I'll ask uh, Blue if she can tell me. And then maybe I'll help her tame it. If I can. If I can. If we can find it. By now it must actually be somewhere else. And the heat wave's still going. Kinda of crazy actually, so you've got a lot of time to tame the phoenix guys. Lots of time to tame the phoenix. Okay, let me just quickly fix my armor here now. Uh, I don't think I need hide actually. I think I just need fiber. Just need some fiber. Just need some fiber. Okay. Ah, there's the hide. Okay, I thought some. I did think I needed some hide. 
What is this though? Is this cloth? What is this? It is cloth. So the shoes need to hide. And so does the gloves. But the rest doesn't. Okay, sweet. Let me put my canteens. Get some water. And I can put my outfit back on. There we go. Outfit back on. Twee. Okay, nice. Come to think of it, I wonder what the Phoenix will actually do against the dummy. We've got a dummy in town. Let me quickly fire this dummy up. Where's the dummy? Oh, guys, did you remove the dummy? Who removed the dummy? <laughs> no! Where's my dummy? Yeah, someone moved the dummy. I don't know why. Morrison, did you move the dummy? I wonder if I was stoning. Your golem destroyed it? No, golems can't destroy it, man. I don't believe that. Really? The golem destroyed the dummy? I'll make another one quickly. Because dummies are meant to take damage. So they don't actually take damage. They just show you what the damage is. Let's make a dummy. We need wood hide fiber and... Yo, that's a lot of thatch though. Holy crap. I think let's go form that quickly. Let's go form that quickly. And the freaking super heat wave is still going. It's insane. I need something that can get a little bit more thatch. I'm gonna be running around here, chopping down every tea for 500 thatch. These are good for thatch. Nice. Okay, we got the thatch. Make another dummy. Fiber and hide. Okay, we got that. We got that. We got that. Mine, got some fiber. Let's make another dummy. Okay, there we go. Do I have the phoenix on me? I oh, know, I put him back. But where am I gonna put this dummy so nobody can destroy this thing again? Put it back up here. Let's put the dummy up here.
Okay. Let's see what the Phoenix does. Again, it wasn't a very high level Phoenix. Let's see. Okay, so one bite is 42 damage. <laughs> Uh, okay. And also, it doesn't set it on fire. It's kind of strange. But maybe because it's a dummy. Does this heal me? Wait a minute. Does this heal me? Let me see. Oh, it doesn't heal me. Okay, that's interesting. You want me to hit you with the Phoenix? Uh, okay, let's take a little bite. I can't because you're in my tribe. I can't bite you. It's not gonna do anything to you because you're in the tribe. Dinos can't do damage or it's not supposed to do damage to other dinos and players except for the Wavens. The Wavens, though, can do lightning damage and stuff like that. So, Marson, if I grab the, the lightning Waven here, I could probably zap you a little bit. I forgot I left the oil in this thing. It's not doing any damage. But if I did that to Scorpe now, he might actually take damage. good he's now actually eating out of a feeding trough wonder if i should put the and it's still a super heat wave that's insane how long is this freaking heat wave or is this now two or three of them after each other this is probably two or three of them back in there just my fiber barrel Patch in the wood we can take upstairs. Alrighty then. Okay, these guys will actually grow up now. I think they'll actually grow up to maturity. They've got plenty of food. Plenty. Might just need milk for imprints, but I'm not worried about them. This one, oh man. Seems like they grow up pretty slow, actually. Because we are just on 11%. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
It doesn't look so cool from the front, but from the side it looks pretty cool. What did I do with all my grappling hooks? I need to go form some metal guys. I need to go get some metal. I'm running out of metal pretty bad. Grab the Anki, where's my RG? We need to go just need some metal. I'll probably just drop the crossbow. Drop all of this. Marson, can you do the cave on a rock golem? I've never tried. I mean, they're pretty big. I'm gonna assume if it fits, you probably can. That's what I would think. Yeah, so if you can get it in there, go for it, go try. You can get it in, see if it'll work. It's a pity I can't show you guys the blue one. I've got no idea where the blue phoenix is. I don't know where um, Vixen saw it the last time or where she even... And by now it would be flying. It could be anywhere. But that is pretty cool. That's a pretty cool one. I'd like to add it to my... Or to the collection of the tribe. Ah, uh, it's okay, Marshall. I'm just gonna quickly come farm here, man. It's all good. I'm gonna make some bullets. I need some bullets for the shorty, for the long neck. We need to make some darts. Our dummy. Can't believe it exactly still eat my <laughs> Yeah, I mean I could go and look for it if you want me to, JB. You can see if you can find it. I just thought by now the heat wave would have ended. Clearly not. This must be a second or a third heat wave. Cause geez, with this time. You don't have to worry about ever losing a phoenix. <laughs> In ASE, you had a storm every hour, and every hour it was random. It could be anything. Electrical, sandstorm, just a normal storm, could be a super heat wave. But here now on ASA, man, it's every five minutes. Sometimes the one ends and the other one immediately starts. I think that's a bit rough, but definitely keeps things interesting. Let me tell you that. Yeah, okay, we're smacking some metal here. Your Jerboa never shuts up. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. Zema had a couple of Jerboas. We immediately cry at them. <laughs> Put them away. Put them away. Yeah, 
Getting some decent metal here. Yeah, we're getting some decent metal here. I can't wait for one of the maps to come out with the Carquinos. I've said it before. Oh. Farming Anki and the Carquinos. Fantastic. Love it. Greenal mod. And no, still heat wave. We are still in the heat wave, boys. Heat wave still hasn't ended. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so my son wanted to join the tribe, and when he joined, I immediately shot his Derboa. <laughs> Sacrifices needed to be made, my son. How are you doing? How's things going? Ah, oh, and it's over! And now it rains. How crazy is that? He lived a good life? Okay. Yeah, now he's, he's in a better place now. Going good, just transferred from the island. What does that mean? You're bringing everything from the island? But we, it's raining. When it rains and you use your canteen, it's supposed to fill the canteen up. What's happening? Not real rain? Ah, okay, okay. So you just did some breathing over on the island quickly. Alright, cool, man. You know what? I think for now, this is enough metal. Let me get my RG. Grab the RG. Grab the RG. Go back to the base. Oh, there we go. Now it pulls the canteens. Strange. Okay, boom, on, it's smelting some metal. Make some bullets. And take this guy back. Put him back, and this one as well. I don't know if I like this name, Panda. It's a bit weird, for a female. Mm. What should I call her? What should I call this RG? I don't know what to call her. I don't know what to say in the beginning, so I just called her Panda. Doesn't even look like a Panda. <laughs> so let's call her. Let's give her a... We'll call her Becky. Shop. 
Then let's take a look at my weapon dribbles. The bay bays. They all still look kinda okay. We'll leave the food in there. Might have to come and just put some food in here for in case. This seems a bit like there's a lot of berries but not enough meat. Oh, and then I need to still feed this thing. I don't know what's going on with its pots. The pots are not working. These pots are not working. What is this even? Pot plants. I need to see if I can get a tree. Where is my shovel? You have to make these pots. Um, so it eats. So plant pot. This is what you have to make. You have to make a, a one of these plant pots, and then you have to get. <laughs> It actually eats more, or it gets, let me put it this way, it gets more food if it's a tree. Smaller the plant, the less food it gets. So you kind of want a tree like this, and then you put them in your hot bar like I did. But it's a bit tricky to get a tree, because the minute you hit the ground or the grass with your shovel around it, Ah, okay, well, that's water now. Like this one. It's gonna add... Ah, oh, this is perfect. This... See? Might have to put these ones out. Might have to quickly just empty these ones. Might be a bit glitchy. Let's see. kidding me okay Stealing my food. <laughs> it's big. Okay, back to feeding the oasis door. I'm just removing this plant. There might be something wrong with this plant. Okay, now we're gonna pick up the pot. Okay. You put them in your hot bar, you take your shovel. Let's hope I get the tree. Bush added. Okay, now let's see. What did it see? It's a bush. So it took one of these bushes now. You need to try and get the tree somehow. Oh, it's taking all the bushes around here. Except. Oh, wait. Tree added. Okay, finally, we got the tree. That's the one. That's the one. You can I can actually now like legitimately plant it. Look at that. Okay. So let's see if we can get one more. Get one more. Re add it. Fantastic. There we go. Yeah, it's a bit annoying. It's it's a little bit annoying. But trees does, or they do give it the most food. 
Okay, and then you come and you just put the plants in its inventory. And it should eat them. Just like that, that's all. But I think my OS saw is slightly broken because he's not eating. Oh wait, there he goes. He just ate this one. I ate that one as well. Okay, cool. He is at least eating. Slowly eating. Come on. And I can't even force feed it. I can't tell it to eat it or... So it either eats it or it doesn't. It's... It's one of those things. But weird. They should have made this a little bit different, I swear. Feeding the thing like this is a bit crazy. I... It's very weird. Very, 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 very weird system. Let's see if we can get this tree. Push. Bush. Another bush. It's just bushes. Which ones did I get? Let's see what did I get. I got that bush. That bush. I got that one. Another heat wave? <laughs> Another heat wave. Okay, that's it. Blue Phoenix time. You want me to go look for a Blue Phoenix? All right. Let's do that. My shovel away. Grab my... Stuff like that. Let's grab my Waverns and then let's go see if we can find that blue phoenix. I just don't know where it is. Which one actually has the most stamina? This one's got 1-3. One, this one's got also 1-3. Okay, it's kind of the same. Alright, let's see if we can find the blue phoenix. So we can find them in this middle area. I'm going to fly around this middle area quickly. See if we can see it. And then we'll head over to the obbies. Maybe the corners. But you don't know where it is. And you could just, just miss it. And from a distance it might look just like an orgy. But, JB, I'm gonna find out from Vixen where she saw it. And if you're on tomorrow night, then uh, by then I'll have at least some idea or course or something to, to show you where it is. Okay, let's fly around this and then we go back the other way. And then we head towards the obelisk, the red obelisk. It could also be stuck somewhere on the ground. But so far we haven't had any of those. They've been actually flying around. No, they kind of fly around. They do move around. It, uh, it depends. Sometimes they stick to the same spot. Sometimes they fly around. It's really difficult to say. They can either spawn here in the middle area. I found in the middle area and by the, the obelisk is probably the best place to look. And then in the corners, they do spawn sometimes, but it's that's a bit rarer.
Hmm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, let's head to the red orb quickly. Let's grab some stamina here. And then we head over to the red orb. Let's see if we can see it. And then we'll go to the blue one, just in case. You can also look for them when there's no heat wave, but I mean, there's so many heat waves. You don't even have to do that. I wonder where's uh, Vixen's little hideaway? She's got like a little house that she built. That might have been the spot where she saw it. So I'll have to ask her. So we need to look carefully. It's gonna look just like an orgy from a distance. Maybe because it's blue, it might actually be better to see it now, but might not be as well. And it could be anywhere, man. It could be anywhere. I'm gonna check here on the ground quickly. Just to see if I can see it. That's the oasis cave. Let's go with this way. That's a top of Yara. It's obelisk. Yes, I almost thought we were lucky. <laughs> that RG, it kind of had me there. Kind of had me there. Finding is so freaking hard. Is that, is that an RG? That's a RG. Oh, that's a pretty topper. Is that a black RG with red wings? Yo, look at that. That's not something you see every day. Not something you see every day. group up hug going on down there okay and then we're gonna go on the outside perimeter of of this area not seeing anything in the air this way because it could also be on the desert side That's the thing, it could be anywhere. <laughs> Shit, I don't know, like, it could be anywhere. <laughs> and as Ark would have it, whenever you are looking for something, you shall not find it. around here could be here as well okay i'm just gonna land here quickly just to get stamina and then we'll continue the search just want to see what this place is all about let's 
there's just some kind of temple they've got built yet. Not even with streamer privilege. <laughs> Finding them is difficult. I did not lie when I said that is the hardest part. Look, I've been lucky. On the stream, I flew into the, the pink one by accident. I was doing something, heat wave, and I flew into it. And, and we saw it. So I was lucky. That was probably my lucky streamer. My lucky streamer RNG. As Graham would actually call it, but... Other than that... It is hard to see them. It's hard to find them. It could be anywhere. Uh, sup water thanks man guys that's a link to discord if you haven't joined it join the discord be awesome to have you guys there's my trap ah heat wave over so there's a next place where i normally find them or I used to find them on ASE a lot as well. It's actually just here by the bridge. The very first bridge. That one. The section here. That sucks. Now we don't know where it is. It can be anywhere now. Anywhere. In this area as well. It could be around here. It could be on the ground. It could be stuck on the ground now. Because sometimes when the heat wave goes away and they go into dust and they go into the soil, that animation doesn't entirely complete. And then you see the phoenix sticking out of the ground halfway. Why does V have an oversized potato in a costume as his image? <laughs> I don't know, Walter. I, I didn't ask questions. I just kind of left him. You know V. He's, v is V. He kind of does whatever V does. I don't, I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine, buddy. Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> Did I ask him? Ask him in general chat in Discord exactly the question the way you posted it there. Let's see what he says. I'm kind of hoping we get lucky and we see it sticking out halfway, but chances of that happening is very, very seldom. <sighs> JB, I would love to show you that Phoenix, man. This can take forever. <laughs> it can take a lot of time. Ah, oh, this is how. Okay, so here's her little house. Now this house is new. I wonder if she saw it around here. Ben, you're at the entrance to the destroyer cave? I didn't I don't have anything on me, man. But let me go grab my stuff. Let me grab my my stuff.
don't think it will be an hour. I doubt it will be an hour, so let me grab my my thyla. Okay, I'll grab my crossbow, my grappling hooks. I don't think I'll need them. I don't recall that cave needing grappling hooks. To a super powered carrot. <laughs> Let's, let's hear what B says, and then we decide, Water, how does that sound? Let's hear what he says first. Kinda like taking a, a long neck with, just in case. And then we'll grab, stock up on some food, which I actually don't have, it would seem. Med bruise. We're ready to rumble. Okay, I'm on my way, Ben. Now, I wonder if she saw it by that little house. Because she had the trap ready, she pre-made the trap, she did everything. So I'm thinking maybe there where she built that little house. If that's where she got the phoenix. No, but if Vicious is a potato and you're a carrot, then Andre needs to be broccoli. <laughs> You guys can do like uh, the veggie group. It could be veggies. <laughs> and I'm an onion? Ah, Marson, I'm not part of that. This is Vicious Water and Andre. They want to be the veggie group. Vicious already changed his image to a potato. <laughs> you wanna be beef stew? Oh, you guys are making me hungry now. Holy shit. But I did this cave, Ben. I've got this artifact. This is not the last cave for me. I did do this one. What do you mean you've got the... Oh, hold on. I'm going to jump into... I'm going to jump into Discord. Join me quickly on... On Discord on 03. While we do the cave. Stop in. Hello? My bed should still be here somewhere. You see? Oh, hey. yeah, you got a bed over there. That's funny. Yeah, I, I did this one. This is not the last one for me. Yeah, well, we could go jump over to the other one to grab the last one if you want or do both. I mean, let's let me let me let's do the other one. Then I've got the three artifacts. Yeah. I can do this one with you. I don't mind. But I did do this one. Yeah, let's I went and grabbed uh, that one, the other one yesterday. It's a really good cave. Let's roll over to the other one. Okay. Might want to just pick up Billy over there. Oh, yeah. Remember last time. Didn't have a cat. Uh, I already forgot the name. Where did I place Destroyer, Craig, and Gatekeeper. Yeah. All right. 
Okay, go for it. Well, what do you think about doing the Manticore here in the near future? We're going to be set for it. It's the weekend, boss fight weekend. Yeah, I was thinking about the Manticore. So my thoughts are we do it with the Fasos. I want to actually get some of the Fasos out, maybe encourage some of the other tribes members to each go and, and see if they can tame a Faso. And then we'll put the best stats together and breed them. They, once they have imprinted on them, they can actually get pretty high HP. So my thought pattern is we can shoot off the Fasos, which means we can shoot the Manticore while it's flying with the shotguns and the stuff. Because there's a lot of times when he doesn't land. And when he does his, like, gas attack, then you can just kind of yeah. go into the sand and sail away, basically. I'm thinking the Fasos will actually do it, and we've got a pretty dang good saddle for it. Got a hundred and seventy-five BP. So with the crafting character, that'll be about two hundred. So yeah, I'm thinking the Fasos. Never done that, so also be new to me. Yep. Yeah, they got their flint like crazy. That is pretty cool. Yeah, they're pretty good with the flint. And we should be able to take out the death wounds quite easily because every time a faso bites something it does armor reduction to it and then it that's how it actually increases its bite every time you bite it bites for harder and more but the raw golems are going to be a bit of a problem i might have to actually take in some tech rifles for us for that one because i did kill all the bosses on the island and stuff yeah my son go try man and i mean guys we can make it a group effort if you guys need some backup or someone to just fly around and clear the area and stuff, we need some more Fasos for better stats. Like to get like a, a really nice high level one. I think I got a 10 pack of grenades on me too. I was planning on doing one this weekend, I think. I needed some metal, but I'm cooking metal now. And if the metal's cooked, I'm just gonna land here for stem. Then... Yeah, good call. I got lots of gunpowder and all the other stuff. It's just the metal that I needed. I can probably make 50 grenades if I have to. Nice. Okay, I'm ready. I think it's below us here somewhere, isn't it? I think it's just over the hill, yep. Oh. Yeah, because I've I got, got it marked started. my map as well. There's the entrance. I think I see it. I'm gonna eat these tawny dragons quickly. You already did this one. I think I did last night. I brought back 29,000 Kite You did it with a Mega <laughs> Yeah Yeah, there's like a thousand scorpions Perfect Don't even need a frog or nothing Okay Please tell me I have a cryopod for my weapon. I do not! That sucks! Oh, didn't. Oh, Ben, I'm sorry. Oh, shit. We're good. Okay. 
no. Sure we gotta oh no, of course he's gonna want to eat the bodies quickly. Listen. Oh yeah. Listen, 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 Yardley. Listen, listen. Come on. Just land. He wants to eat this one. Beasts. There'll be scorpions right at the entrance. After we get down there. I guess not right at the entrance. Do we need a torch? I got one. But I mean, do we need one? I need to make one. No. So you're just looking no, cool I just with got your purple cool flame. One. <laughs> yeah, check that out. I saw it. It looks pretty cool. That's the skin we got from the other one the other night. Last yeah. night, last yeah, night, yeah, the, the skin. You get, you get a torch skin and a spear skin and four skin. No, wait, no, not four skin. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My bad. <laughs> All right, here we go. Scorpion time. Oh, wait, there's lots of water here. You can actually bring the fast for a swim here. So, what's in the water over here? Did you check? Uh, yep. And what you find? Eventually, you'll pipe one of the rock golems down there, and we can murder it down there. A little bit of silicone. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Millions of scorpions. Look at those cool ones. And I don't know if this is a leak, but they got a fix that you can tame cave creatures. I was actually thinking about that. Well, it's always been if they're higher than 150, you can't. If they're lower than 150, you can. Oh, wow. Wrong. I can't oh. do nothing to me. Okay, this is a problem. Send the saddle. Send it south. Do you need help? Do you need help? Yeah. I can't shoot him. I'm under the water. Oh, fuck. There's like 10 things. Um, there's also cave dismount. In this thing. So you can just randomly dismount. So prepared to jump back on after random dismounts. Just contact the wall. Jeez Louise. I think you're, your thylus yeah. clear. Your thylus clear. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Bats. There's a couple bats. We got butter pump on too, so that's. Oh, gotta be kidding me. I'm about to die because I'm gonna fall asleep. You good? Oh no. You good? Yeah. <laughs> wow. I mean, this started off with a bang. Yeah. Yeah, let's get this guy some bleed damage. Ah, I'm on my way. I don't think I'm gonna kill him though. He's just a rubble gold. He's not even a Oh he's a 35. Yeah, we might be able to kill this one. I think there's about four in here. With the RNG. You good? Yeah, no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. All right, <laughs> perfect. No worries. Let me just uh, grab some fiber here. Just realized that I didn't bring a bed, and that's always when things go wrong. Is when you don't have a sleeping bag or a bed or anything. Watch me yeah. put this down. I now. got a coffin. I think we can. Well, we need the coffin. Watch me put this down now, and then there'll be no problem anymore. Oh yeah, perfect. Yep. JB, I perform actually my best when things go wrong and haywire and there's chaos everywhere. You'll see, you'll notice. 
might not look it now, but you'll be surprised, man. Good looking cave, though. Okay, go, Mr. Uh, Megatherium. He just flattened these scorpions for us. <laughs> Oh my god, they're coming in from above. There's like seven of them. <laughs> I'm just standing back oh my god. just going. This is this is where I died on my own. Like the first time I came down here I died right here. On my Thyla. I got knocked out, went unconscious, broke all my armor. And then you decided, well Man, this was kicking my ass. I'm just gonna come in here with this thing and we're gonna just rock it like this. Yeah, I'm gonna just do chit and buff and destroy the place. <laughs> what do they call it? Insect killer! <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! Thousand damages! Damage. <laughs> Listen, there should be a loot crate right here. Ah, oh, wait, here's the next one. Okay, go, yeah, There's let him face yeah. you if you can get around him. I can tank him with some ascended saddles and that's. I'm gonna try and jump around him. Yeah, so I don't have an insane saddle on my thigh now. No! Oh, gee. Yeah, there's usually a blue loop crate right here. It was yesterday. Maybe it hasn't been 24 hours, I guess. Respawns on it. Yeah, I already had a ditch like 10,000. He's like doing two damage to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Even the damage to you. If I don't have the chitin buff, the uh fucking set killer on, he he does like twenty. What's down here? What's down this way? Does it just meet does it, does it meet up? Okay. Oh, this thing's got like an AoE charm. Like they just made this thing perfect. <laughs> like, hey, hello, fifty scorpions. We're just gonna eat you all at once. <laughs> You're having a great time. Black box. Black box. Ah! Dismount. Random dismount. I'm oh, gonna shit. get zapped. I got you, I got you, I got you, Ben. I got you, Ben. Or I, I don't know, Ben. I don't know, Ben. I got this. <laughs> I got this. And you're gonna sleep. I, got... I promise you, you're gonna take a nap. Get you somewhere safe. Stims. You got stims? Got stims. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Assholes. Maybe I need some stims. You need some stims? I got like a 60 pack on me. Nah, it's okay. I got some. Got some stim berries. My, my son says, get that your... man up below. <laughs> hold on, hold on, wait, wait. Okay, I got you. Alright, threw some on your cat. Alright, thanks. <laughs> You're good. This is a nice place, man. Imagine building a base down here after you block all the spawns. <laughs> I know, this is one of the other caves. Uh, it's not the Oasis cave, Dova. Yeah. This is not the this Oasis. This was uh, Cave of the Tyrants. Grave of Tyrants. Yeah, Grave of Tyrants. Oh man, I actually did fall asleep. <laughs> despite all the stims I ate. I wasn't paying attention, I was looking at actual printouts of the map that I can't see in black and white. <laughs> okay, but you're good. You're yeah, good. I think so. Yeah, I got it, I got it. I know what you need, Bane. I know what you need. Bane, I know what you need. <laughs> force, force feed them stims, yes. No, 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 no. I know what you need. I know what you need. All you <laughs> need is a little bit of water. There's a little bit of water. My, to the face. Splash. My vitals are my minor vitals were good. Yeah. There we go. Okay, now that'll wake you up, guys. Whenever oh. someone passed out, definitely drag them and put them in water. 
Don't do that. It's a terrible idea. So, with the Megatherium, you can get randomly dismounted on the walls. And then Scorpions can quadruple team you. You thought I was going to say mouth to mouth? Jeez, JB. No, there's only special people that get that kind of treatment. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for keeping me alive. Ah, uh, you're most welcome, man. Like I said, you just needed like a little splash of water around the face. That's all. You good? You good? A little bit tap tap. I'm not going into that water. There's top rows down there, so I'm just going over here. There's definitely a Capro here somewhere. I can hear him growling. And a Mantis that's... I don't... I'm not sure what he's doing. Maybe that's like some kind of weird mating ritual. <laughs> Let's see. I think Mantises are awesome in this game. They're pretty cool. Take him down to the water's edge lovingly in your arms. That's the one. That's the one. Do you want to send me scorpions right here? Or are you ready to have So, Java says, saying hello in Mantonese. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but is this where I come in again? Oh, there's a bear. Oh gosh, so I'm oh, not going to take the shit. same design. Oh shit. Are you going to get How the door? How does the wolf? Ben, I got some good news and some bad news. <laughs> oh no. Be good. I'm not sure. The good first. Ah, I'm dismounted! No! I had to abandon shit. No. Mr. White's gonna do the business down there. I got randomly dismounted. He'll, he'll take up. That's kind of weird. It's like he wants to. Look at him. He's like, I want to. But my boss isn't here to tell me I have to. <laughs> Come on, Mr. White. You can do it very close. Yeah, see, we're taking 155 damage from that thing. Like I, my uh, Mega just takes like 20. <laughs> okay, perfect. Are we, are we mate boost yet? We are. Perfect. Billy, Billy's a... Uh, Opposite female here. My mind's telling me no, but my body's telling me something else. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like that. Okay, well, uh, you might wanna I just cry out your thyla there. Uh, yeah, yeah, I could. Or do you want the mate boost? Nah, it's okay. Fun. I'll keep high. We're at the, we're at the are artifact. You, are the you artifacts sure? Right here. Okay. Yeah, um, artifacts right here. We're good. Yeah. Oh, there I see we it. are. There we are. Not a single drop in this cave. What kind of shit is this? Well, I did do it less than 24 hours ago, but that yeah, is kind of shit. Considering there's like seven drop locations, and I only got like three last time. Oh. 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 Quick spawn. There was a rock golem in here. I made it through the whole thing solo, and then there was a rock golem right in this room. And then that's <laughs> so I had one it, more big fight. And then that's what it ended for you. <laughs> Did you Tyler beat the golem? Uh, I was using the mega. Oh. Okay, well then that's that then, I guess. I mean, it looks pretty yep. cool. Look at that. I don't That's... Think there's any. There's no. 
Oh, that looks pretty cool. There's no real secret rooms or anything. Well, there is one tunnel back on the way back that we can take a left turn. JB, I told you. I told you the minute you have a bed or a sleeping bag, no problem. But don't have one. <laughs> then all hell breaks loose, man. That's the secret. Okay, sweet, cool, Ben. Shit, are you gonna be able to get out of the cave, though? Okay, you're gonna wait here? Alright, sweet, I'm gonna go. And to our right, we have a very peculiar snail. It is called the Akatina of Death. I mean, he is doing a very peculiar balancing act on the tip of his tail. Arthur's jump from the thigh line is so broken. He fix it. <laughs> the man caught the artifact and dip is like, snap, I'm out. Nah, I think Ben had to go and do something. It sounded like he got some guests or something there. Ooh, I am not touching this water. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Shit, I might have to. No, I'm not. I'm not. We are not touching the water. And this mantis is still going. Look at him. He's still going. It's just. I got this. You got it, buddy. <laughs> did I just jump over that one? I just did. I swear, I just jumped over that one. That's crazy. Oh. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna go this way. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. There we go, kitty. What's up, boys? Oh, no! I have been whipped. Okay, we have to fight. We'll have to fight our way out of this one. Three levels. That's quite heavy stuff. Let's drop that. It's up my melee. Ooh, Capro, Capro, son. Oh. Where is that? Come on. I, this thing can never jump over there. This thing's he's gonna eat me. Okay, we got it. See, that's what I was afraid of. Because the Tyler only jumps up. He doesn't jump forward anymore. For some unknown reason. Is that sound? It sounds very ominous. It sounds like a volcano erupting. Oh, it's it's a storm. Never mind. That sound is just a storm. Let's take the hide. I'm gonna actually take the meat. Take all of this. Got some bully again. That's pretty good. Arrows. Or hide. Of course it's a storm. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I was maybe hoping for something majestical, but nah. Does the sandstorm. 
where I've been. I don't have another cryo on me. I'm gonna just park your Raven in here. Hopefully that's okay. With that. There we go. My son, I do not, unfortunately. What do you want to tame with cooked lamb? Oh, look at my shadow. That is pretty cool. Use cooked prime. Cooked prime will also do the trick. The rates are... The rates on the server are actually good enough that you don't need any mutton. You can just use cook prime. It's a torch. I already have the... We got the other artifacts and the skins and stuff yesterday, Java. So I've got the one for the, the sword and the other stuff. This one was the torch. I can't see where I'm going. We're going somewhere. Oh, there we go. Jeez, Louise. Now let's just quickly empty all the sand. Yeah, my son, you can actually just do it with Cook Prime. You don't need mutton, man. You really don't need mutton. Cook Prime will do pretty good. What you need, what you need, what you need. Cuddles, 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 cuddles. What? Why do you want milk? Why do you want milk? Why do you want milk? It's cuddles, buddy. Cuddles or nothing. There. Be happy. <laughs> Yeah, which one? Eight minutes. Nineteen minutes. Good timing. Good, 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 good timing. Okay, I'm gonna throw this bad boy out here. He can just get some heelsies himself. We'll put the organic polymer in the storage pan. Let's go. No. That doesn't work anymore, Java. Not at all anymore. They fixed it. Wildcard said it was never meant to work like that, so they fixed it. So now you gotta give it what it asks for. Doesn't matter how many times you cry and throw it out, it's not gonna change it. The only thing that can change it is the Giganto Raptor, but it can change it once. And that's it. This is an Atrado server. It doesn't work anymore. I promise you guys. They completely, completely, completely changed it. I'll cry out one of the dinos now and keep on throwing him out. You'll see. It stays to one thing. It doesn't change it anymore. Not anymore.
It could be, yeah. It could be because you're using a modifier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but the official cryos like this doesn't change it. New. Yeah, well, let's put. Now we've got all three artifacts, I do believe. We've got the destroyer, we've got the crag, and we've got the gatekeeper. Okay, fantastic. When did I put those skins though? Ah, here's the sword and here's the pike. There's the spear kind of thing and there's the sword. This one's going to be asking for something in five minutes and I'll cry away and throw him out a few times and you'll see. Doesn't change it. Unfortunately. I kind of understand why though. I kind of understand why though. Makes, it makes sense to a degree. I mean, that's why you're supposed to have all kinds of jerkies and kibbles and all kinds of stuff so you can not only tame things, but also imprint the babies the right way. The babies. Why is Kabora? <laughs> <laughs> but why is Gamora? Yeah. Why is there a smithy here now? Okay. Oh, fantastic. Another sandstorm. Gotta love him. Gotta love him, man. Gotta love him. Gotta love these sandstorms. Okay. How far are you, buddy? Two minutes, three minutes. Perfect. Is it me or is it colors kind of changing as they oh it might just be the light it might just be the light that's a beautiful sandstorm <laughs> looks pretty open cheeky breaky
I actually wanted to raise this one a little bit. Cool name, Cheeky? Yeah, I thought so too, because of the bones, the cheekbones. That's actually where it comes from, Liz, these cheekbones. I mean, look at that. Those cheekbones. Cheeky. <laughs> One minute remains. Oh, Yorli, you've been such a good girl. You have been such a good girl. Spittle. I can see why you're saying that, Java, but I don't know if that would have been a good name, though. Twenty-eight seconds and counting. This is gonna be a good way, man. It's a pity it's not as nice color as this one, but still, it's gonna be dang hot. 10 seconds okay hopefully it asks for something cool something like cuddles or a walk and not milk not milk not milk mother buffer it's asking for milk okay check so All right cryo throw up wave and milk cryo throw out Wave and milk. Cryo. It's not gonna change. Throw out. Wave and milk. Doesn't. Bust it. Now I need to go get milk again. In fact, let's cryo these guys quickly. I can cryo this one as well. And then we'll... I need one more cryo. Like Squirtle. Lizardish. <laughs> Squirtle is pretty cool. I like Squirtle. That's a cool name. Squirtle. How many imprints? One imprint is 12%. Are you telling me I'm going to imprint this thing eight times? Yeah, these new... I took all... I went into our INI files and I changed it. So I made our cryopods very much like the old ones, except if the dino takes damage, you've got 60 seconds and you have to wait before you can cryo it. That's the only thing I can't change, but you can throw it out anywhere, you can do kind of everything that you could have done beforehand. You're gonna hop on, you need a moth? Oops. I don't understand why we have. Probably easier to use the metal there. It's not a problem. Squirtle. <laughs> That's a pretty cool name, actually. Squirtle. I need to go get one of these. The Deathworm trophy. Yeah, we need to go get one of those. But that's it, guys. That's me for tonight. Thank you so much, guys, for sticking around. JP, it was awesome to have you on the stream. I hope you joined Discord. I hope to see you again. Jobba, Lee, my son, Marson, everybody else. Everybody else. Have a good one, guys. I'll catch you guys tomorrow night. Just boys.